that's us. All right, <laughs> I'm, rec- I'm recording now. Are we good? Yeah. Great. Right. Hi, guys. Welcome to <laughs> the Egg in a Bottle podcast, episode six. What are you turning down your, headf- your, your headphones for? Am I too loud for you? You're pretty loud. <sighs> I'm Mark the Conch Ortega. I'm sitting here with Kyle Dick Watts. Kyle Dick Watts. Do- That's not what that means. Shut up. That and is- Georgia, you don't have a nickname, Lata. Back again. Me. She was gone last week. What a fucking loser. <sighs> yeah. Now she's back. Mark, Mark said our be- together. Mark said our best episode was last week when you I were know. not because you I weren't know. there. Literally, no. I was like, "How was the episode last week?" And he was like, "Oh, it was so good. It, it was, was amazing. It was fun. Whatever. I was like that was just. It was average at best. Enough. I don't know why Kyle doesn't like things. <sighs> I don't know either. <laughs> 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 That's fair. Oh. Um, it's very difficult to please. How was your week, man? Pretty good. Did you just nod? Yeah, I, I can't did. Hear I don't you know nod. why I did that. Jesus but Christ. I did. I was actually kind of swallowing, so I was like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was like, good, <laughs> uh, <laughs> fantastic. No, it wasn't bad. It was a, it was a pretty short week. It was, and I've been off a lot of these days, and I'm off again Hell from yeah. work until Sunday. Yes, sir. I'm quite happy. Noise, noise, noise. I was. Really nice. They uh, someone asked me to come in yesterday, but me and Mork were doing stuff. Yeah, we were. That I can't put a name to, but it'll get us in prison. It'll get mm. us in something. It'll get us in something because we were. In, I was fucking him. Yeah. Oh, that's what I thought what was, that it was. <laughs> I, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I knew that this would happen eventually. It's already happened. It's. Yeah. It's been. Happening. How does your uncle feel about that one? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, really going back. <laughs> back a couple, couple episodes. Days. Yes, sir. Uh, days. He, he's a fan. He watched. He's a fan. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> he's really into what's it called voyeurism. Oh, Excuse me. G- that's when you. I'm gonna vor someone. No, like not voyeurism. Vor. Not <laughs> voyeur. Vor. Vor. vor is when you eat somebody whole. Yeah. <laughs> what's wrong with vor? You got a problem with? Shut vor? up. <laughs> yes. No. I have a serious problem with vor. You actually. Never mind. Maybe because it's not a thing that can be actually. Why do you achieved. look like you're hiding something about vor? I'm not hiding anything about vor. Stop or saying vor like vor-ring. that. Vor. Vor. Vor ring. Is that the proper way to say it? You just said proper, not proper, and that offended me proper. so much. You said proper. Voring. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what proper vor <laughs> protocol is. <laughs> Who should we ask about that? Should we ask? <sighs> I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> we, okay, something happened before we started recording, and it almost made me just want to be like, pack it up, guys. We're going home. I it's not worth it? That really? Going to. Like, almost. Genuinely, I thought oh. you were going to be like, okay, let's just stop. I, I thought that you were going to. No, he'll be okay. No, because like, I, I actually thought he was going to kick us out. Yeah. And be like, hey, I need you guys to leave. Oh, well. Because we'll he's be been cool next week. to me a lot. Like, like, he's a cool guy. Don't get me wrong. Kyle. What? I am brown. Disadvantage me. What does that mean? I don't know. Yeah, I don't. I mean, he was cool to you. I mean, you know, you yeah. were in the wrong, you know. I never said that I wasn't. I know you didn't. For the record, for people who are curious, I left my fake penis on the table in the <laughs> studio and he had a problem. <laughs> With its suction cup? Yes, and the sound that it made, especially when it came off the suction cup, he was not a fan of. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, whoa. Not a fan. Uh, uh, Oh, oh God! Uh, oh God! Didn't like that. It's a sound it made. I know that was horrible. Even I had to like it, but uh, oh God! Yeah, we got uh, we got roasted by a professor in it's here for a few minutes. Fine, and uh, I honestly could listen to that guy just tell me stories about radio. He has days. a good voice. He's got a great voice. I'd get you oh, heard he could, yeah. he could yell at me any day. Uh, if you if you listen to ninety one point nine. Clark, if you're in the area, no late. one listens to us. We can't afford to be plugging other. people. I'm just things. saying, like if you if you happen to listen to us and you're in town, listen to 91.9. <laughs> you okay. hear Doc V. Fair enough. He's the the deep voice guy. Yeah. Georgia. Yes, sir. How was your week? It was pretty good. Week eight. <laughs> <laughs> week eight of college. Weeks yep. are just getting more and more difficult. And you're right. I'm yeah. finding it harder and harder to wake up in the morning. To stay alive. I had four papers to do. Oh, wow. Yeah. I had a pretty so. light week this week, which I'm really glad for. No, school doesn't. School's wait, not the problem. Wait, How was your fall break? I didn't do anything. I worked. Oh, no. Sad times here <laughs> in the booth. I had Sad a good times break. at the El Royale. <laughs> There's the door, Kyle. <laughs> I had a good fall break though. That's that's good. That's good for you. What did you do? What did you do? Um, me and my man's. We went to Columbia to visit his friends, and we ate dinner there. And then 
we went to my house in Lebanon and stayed there. I'm going to stop you right there before it gets too much. Is it going to get too much? Mm-mm. Okay, good. I went to the hockey game on Monday. Yeah, you did. I saw that. That was a good game. Good. Was it the Jets one? No, it was Wilds. Wilds. Minnesota. Minnesota. I was gonna do the same thing, man. <laughs> they're playing. To, they're playing tonight. They're playing the Calgary Flames. Excuse me. Time yes. to get shut out again. Shut up. More fucking sports talk. <laughs> Sorry. I hope they don't. I think they'll win tonight. I, really I really heard. Do too. I, hope I think they, they got to die. Because <laughs> okay, they 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 dropped the banner. Well, what banners were they dropping that night? Uh, President's Trophy um, and Division. Yeah, we won our right. division. They you're and they were and they were yeah. putting those, uh, putting those banners down during the Calgary game, mm. and uh, we proceeded to lose three to zero. We did not score. Not once. Not one time. But we got shut out in our own building on know, banner night. <laughs> honestly, though, like the beginning of the hockey season is so uneventful. It's it, to me, it gets more intense. A game like between 50 and 60 because that's when we it's will when, know if yep. we're going to finals like by game 60 we'll know if I we're mean, going I mean not yes. lot can happen well I mean yeah there's a lot of games a lot, oh I, I, I see what you're saying because yeah because after that there's only like 30 some odd games left and then you're like okay there's right, 22 now, after that yeah now every there's 82 <laughs> games in a regular season so yeah. if we have 50 There'd be thirty-two. Well, I meant after a uh, game sixty. After six, gotcha. yeah, that's, yeah, after that's twenty-two. Yeah, you're right. But I agree. I, now that I think about it like that, I agree. Actually, it's about that point. It's like okay, you kind of need to win every game. Exactly. I mean, yeah. you need to win every game anyway. But at this point, if we lost to Calgary tonight, I mean, I'm not gonna. No, exactly. I'm not I'll gonna be pissed, worry about but it, I'm but gonna be like, oh, our season's not over because yeah, we exactly. lost tonight. It just gets more intense for me at those games because, like you said, like we need to win, and so it's we more fun. Always need to win because all we do is win. Win, win. No, no matter, matter what. what <laughs> the hands go up. Oh, Lord. That's and they stay there. That's the show, guys. We'll see you here next week. <laughs> God. Uh, How's your week, Mark? I didn't do jack or shit. Boring week. Boring week. Boring. Shorter, but I didn't like it because it was shorter. I didn't do anything. I'm getting involved. Uh, uh, what? I, I'm i sorry. I was leading into a story there that's not relevant to what you just Your said. Your segue is dog shit, it's, man. You got to work on it. It was good a minute. It was good last <laughs> it week. It was good before week. I started talking, and then I realized, <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> it's uh, It's been a slow week. Yeah, it has. It's been kind of slow, and uh, the most eventful thing just happened before we started recording. <laughs> so, I mean, like, honestly, yes. That's the, most that's the first time thing. he's ever gotten on to me about anything. He, he didn't get on to you about anything. Well, I, I thought he was about to ro- like get on to me about how I was moving the mic around. I mean, and I'm he, like, he did, but a little bit, and yeah. I'm like, I, okay, <laughs> that's all Sorry. I could say. That's you're right, you're right. Yeah, I mean, you you really ate the sandwich, as they say. Ate the sandwich, literally. Yeah. As my, no, the problem is he didn't eat the sandwich beforehand. You're right. What's oh, the problem? Damn. I got it right before my, my my last class, and I couldn't eat it in my last class, and I was hungry. <laughs> and you told me about it. You were like, we, we were walking to our uh, last class today, and you're like, hey, I'm going to grab some Subway. Do you mind if I eat on the show? I was like, I don't give a fuck. And then, <laughs> uh, and then I, I didn't really think about the fact that somebody else might give a fuck. We opened that. that door, which means we all saw the sign. <laughs> Did you see the sign? I'm not looking see, at the, the waist level like, when I opened the door. Well, no, it's just like... I feel like they told us, and we're just like, oh, yeah, okay, no Oh, it food. definitely did just went over but our heads. I didn't even think about Neither it. Neither did I. Like, when you walked into it, like, I didn't even look at it. I was like, oh. No, okay. it's, I was, like, looking through It's below the, the waist. I'm not looking there when I open a door, you know? Yeah. <sighs> Still times. our fault, but it's fine. It is. We won't we're, do it again, I'll tell you that. We're Gucci. We're Gooch. Won't happen again. No, Don't sir. Don't ever say that. What was that? Don't ever say that. Say what? Gooch. Why can't I say it's Gooch. Things are gooch. Things are gooch, man. Gooch. Gooch. I mean, the, <laughs> I mean, the gooch is the region between the... Well, whatever. I got a camera. Take a, my picture right now. I rented it. <laughs> and uh, I'm figuring out how to use it. Can you tell us why? Why did you get Why it? do you need to take I'm pictures taking pictures for? after the podcast. I know, but what for? To put on his for? Tinder account. Georgia. <laughs> is that what I said? Yes. Yes. It I is. didn't say that. Not here, but out there in the real world, you did. <laughs> did I? I don't in remember. In the real world. No, I, I I have it downloaded, but I'm like, eh, I don't know. Got you. So why are you taking Ladies. pictures exactly? Because I don't have any really nice, mo- like, up-to-date pictures of myself. That's fair. Me I don't either. have many. Like, I have I have one from prom night, which I kind of like, and that's my Instagram profile picture, yeah. but that's about it. Noise. 
Uh, I have one from uh, sophomore year of high school. I was wearing this shirt, and it's my PlayStation 4 profile <laughs> picture. It's a good shirt, you guys. Just I don't know if you, you guys cannot see it, but it's a good shirt. <sighs> I, it's my favorite shirt. I love it. I, I, w- I got fat, and then I couldn't fit in it anymore, <laughs> and then I got skinny again. Or, you know, I lost some weight. Now we then, can fit in it again. Yeah, I can yeah, it's a good, fit. It's a good nice. shirt. Correct. Yeah. It's like getting a new shirt. <laughs> is it, though? It is. Because, okay, have you ever, like, forgotten that you had a shirt for, like, months, and then you find it, and then it's like getting a new shirt? I guess. It is. I guess you're right. We're uh, just going to let her have this one. I might shop for a shirt after this as well. You're going you're gonna, to you're gonna leave from this and go shirt shopping? I might. Are you a father of 12? No, right. I'm going to look for a shirt, and then I'm going to go to Books a Million, probably. What are you doing a good old BAM? What are you gonna? What book are you? Don't gonna look get? at me like that. It's called Bam. Purchasing a book. I know, jackass. Mork. But <laughs> what book? Uh, I think I'm gonna get Fifty Shades. Yes. That's what I, I actually bought all of those recently. Actually, have you read them? No, not yet. I haven't had the time to start it yet. I think I'm gonna get uh, Herodotus's Histories. He's a Greek. My headphones might must not be working. What did you just say to me? Herodotus. <laughs> He's a he, he's the first, he's considered the father of history, the mo- father of modern history, because he was the first one to write a history book. That's Sounds not like what the most history interesting is. Book the father of ever. history is the first man to be born. What I mean is-, is I know what you mean, I just don't like it. He's the first man- To write things down. To write a, a history book. Cool. That sounds really interesting. It's all Her- it's, it's what's n- Herod- oh, fuck. Herodotus? Yeah, it's just called Histories. Oh. Because it's the first history book. He gets to just call his book History. Got you. You know, everybody else had to. Georgia. <laughs> she yawned and didn't c- cover her fucking mouth. She ate the mic. Uh, uh. <laughs> hey, Doc B's coming back in. Is he really? Yep. Did you make me look? I did. Got him. <laughs> this is going to be the last episode of the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what have we done now? <laughs> <laughs> Kyle, because the goddamn mic stand. You got your feet up. No. I, dude, if he walked around and saw you without shoes, he'd probably make us leave. I'm. That's why. That's why I like put him on as he was <laughs> talking. I was like, "Fuck!" You were like, oh god. I was were like, "Were you putting them on while he was speaking?" Yes. I saw you bit down, but I was like, "What is he doing?" Like, kind of low key. Nothing good. Down. I was. I was doing that because I was like, "We don't need this. Let me just <laughs> fix this real quick." <laughs> we don't need this. Um, Mark, it really feels like you're louder than me. Am I? I th- well, that's it's the same for me. I just sound quieter than everybody else. All right, what's the first topic today? Jesus Mork? Christ! Okay. <laughs> While we're on the subject of Tinder and all that, what, what not, all that nonsense, dating shit. George actually brought up something very interesting. We were sitting the in the day. black room. The <laughs> context is very important. We were sitting in the black room. And then, okay, <laughs> on the <laughs> second floor of our library. Don't explain it. Don't shut explain up. It. There, I have. I can't say no, the black room in good stance. It, it has to be explained. Don't explain it. You're outvoted. Fine. We were sitting in the fucking black room. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. And <laughs> we were discussing Tinder. No, I don't have a Tinder anymore. Um, I had it for approximately like three days, but. I made the point that if he, if Kyle here were to get a Tinder, he would have to be the one to message the girls because girls never message the guys on t- on Tinder. I ever. think that's dog shit. You might think that that's dog shit, but that's how society works. Well, society is also dog shit, so... I'm just saying. Society also accepts that the world is round. Oh, okay. oh fuck. We're okay. not bringing we're gonna go. We're, we're going to move forward from that. <laughs> Kyle, what are your thoughts on this women bullshit? It's horseshit, isn't it? It's absolute bullshit. Because you, you, it's you easy guys for me, though. both ma- shut up. I you, know it is. Because you, you guys both match at the same time, which means you both know at the same the time. The onus you guys is on both of you, exactly. At that point, and yeah. you expect. Like I get it if it only sent like a message to the guy saying, "Hey, you guys match. Make a fucking move, dog." But if you both it's get not it, like that, yeah, yeah. It, it's see, it's fucking. It's you ridiculous. miss out on a lot okay. by not taking the first. Yeah, move. your fucking okay, ego also, is slapping your chances at your at your hands. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh so I don't know if it's the same for everybody, but with my Tinder, when I had it for like literally no Thrice lie, I had days. it for seventy two hours max, and this was before school had even started. But 
I would like swipe right or whatever. Like I was having fun doing it because it was kind of like a game. Like it was just a lot of fun. But I would have like seven. Think it's a motherfucking game. Yeah, I would have like seven messages. You know, like come all at once. So I don't even have time to message other guys because I'm already having so many. Are we supposed to be impressed? No, I'm saying the point is, is like, why would I take time out of my day to message somebody when they're already messaging me? But what if you see someone you're interested in, but they don't message you? Why don't you message Why them? should I take because the time to talk to somebody else when I'm already talking to somebody right now? Like, Kyle, exactly. I get that I'm speaking to you, but why should I put any effort into speaking to Georgia? <laughs> this it's is whack, right? It's awful. It's of Tinder. It's ridiculous. Well, the laws are dumb. Yeah. Why you. should I involve everybody in the room? You know, right? When what? I'm already talking to one person, I'm in, talking to you right room. now. Yeah. We don't even really, you know. No. <laughs> Say it. We don't need her. We Say don't it. need <laughs> her. Are you done? <laughs> Are you done? No. The point is, is that. Sorry. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's already okay. It's it's the amount of. I haven't been on Tinder myself, mm -hmm. but from what I understand, it's a lot of fishing and not a lot of bites. Well, so, yeah. So, um, <laughs> sorry, it's <laughs> a funny way to put it. <laughs> um, so, like, be, having to make the first move all the time. You just get I used just, to it. I, okay, I'm aware. I'm a gentleman. <laughs> I've been a gentleman for 18 years. I know what it's like. You now. can just be like, "Hey," that, that's easy to say. Girls hate it when you start with "Hey." What do you mean? It's what dumb. do you mean? I started with started start with something else. Like what? Like anything other but hey. What's up? Tell me something. Like what do Just you use? Do it, sorry, I don't use it. But I, I, you know, on those little Snapchat no, saying, things okay. where they have those like Snapchat story things of like new shit or or, or whatever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Those explore things. Yeah. Mm. There was a survey they did, and apparently girls are more likely to respond if you don't start off with hey. They're less likely if you just say hey. Honestly, that's true. What should you say then? Anything else. Uh, I'm I don't Mark. Know. Like, Let's fuck. Like, do anything yeah. that's not I don't, hey. <laughs> I mean, sometimes it would be like weird puns. Just throw a bad pickup line. They love yeah, that like shit. Yeah, like bad Do you really? Lines. Do, do um, Generally? <laughs> I mean... It follows the attractiveness rule. Correct. It works if two things are in place. <laughs> One... You are attractive, and two, you are not unattractive. <laughs> then how, everything works. That's how I'd say most things work. Yeah. That was so my life. Hey, girl, are you today's date? Because you're 19 out of 10. That's <laughs> that's not bad. I'd get in bed with me if I said that to myself. I'm like, damn, he's good. <laughs> <laughs> this is not the worst I've ever heard. Isn't honestly. it? That's not bad. Thank you. So, like, okay, honestly though, like, what? What would someone if if hey doesn't work for you? Okay, let's just say you. Okay. Since you're the only girl here at the moment. Okay. Fair. Um, if a guy, what would you want a guy to say that would make you go like, oh, I'm gonna reply to that one? Honestly, like I <laughs> don't know. You just know it when you see it. I guess so, but the thing is, is like, like I said, I had Tinder for three days. I how many haze did you get? Three thousand. Probably. <laughs> hey. <laughs> wow. All uh, varying amounts of whys at the end. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just Tinder is so dumb, Loki. It's really bad. It's it's good if you're just trying to meet up with somebody and have sex with them and then go. <laughs> like no life. <laughs> All right. No, Kyle just look. This like look, Kyle. Like, yeah, he's got a. She's she's got a point. I'm just Shit. yeah. I mean, you're not wrong. Be how it be. That's just how it is, and. That's why it's I just that's it. the, that's what the app is known for. So yeah. correct, it can't change its brand. Yeah, and its brand is. I'm sure there was a study done where it was like, how long does it take for a girl to be able to hook up with a immediately? Guy on like it probably takes minutes for men. It's it, months. It doesn't minutes. take minutes. Men it takes of planning seconds. and setup. <laughs> you walk into a room. Like any, any no on any Tinder. Oh, still that's what second. I'm saying. It's still second. Second, still second. E even probably even less because it's online. Guys, it's so weeks. you match. Yeah, because you. So Kyle, th it, this <laughs> was you, right? So you match with, uh, with somebody, and a girl is like, "Hey, want to fuck?" And then you're just like, "Yeah," and then I mean, that's it. Then it's done. It's a yeah, but set girls deal. aren't like that. That doesn't exist. Well, that's a metaphor. Like, I don't think that's actually how it works. Like, who, <laughs> how many, Mark? Have What's you that? ever run into somebody like on those types of websites? I don't know if you've ever used. It. Have you used it? What Tinder? No, no. Mm -mm. Um, anything like it? 
I almost said grinder. <laughs> <laughs> you look like you would use grinder. Thanks, friend. She says you look gay. I know what it fucking meant. <laughs> <laughs> Just hey, Mark, you look like you gobbled dick. <laughs> anyway. Okay, no, I haven't, Kyle. Why? Why do you... Because my question is, like, is it? Uh, d- does the conversation ever go like that? It's like, hey, hey, let's fuck. Okay. <laughs> Never. Okay. That's, why I, that's what I'm saying. Yes. It, it just seems like... No. It doesn't seem like it does that very often. It's always no, like, hey, 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 situation. what's up? Just chilling. What about you? Same. <laughs> <laughs> that seems How was your day? to me. It was whatever. You. It was cool. Cool. And then nothing. <laughs> that you get ghosted after that, because yeah. then you're boring. And I don't... Have you ever ghosted somebody? Yes. No. Really? Wait, I think we talked about this. No, we haven't. I'm always the ghosty, not the ghoster. <laughs> Let me the say ghosty. this. I never... <laughs> I've been... Yeah, I I, you, I think I have ghosted before. Have you been ghosted? Not that you know of? completely. How would you not yeah, know Yeah, yeah, I have. Yeah, yeah. Yes. The answer is yes. She told me she died. Wait, she wouldn't tell you that she... <laughs> she Died. She'd be <laughs> dead at that point. Her friends told me she died. She just moved to Kansas. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> like I gold- thought it was Sorry. funny. <laughs> Your goldfish ran away, Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> Our dog didn't die. He's he's on that special farm. <laughs> <laughs> no, but honestly, I just... Okay, George, I see what you're saying about the whole, like... Well, actually, I don't see what you're saying. <laughs> but, uh, about the whole text and first thing. It is, this is my question. If you see something and a girl is like, oh, that's a nice hunk of meat right there, or whatever <laughs> they say, I don't know. Uh, yeah, that's exactly. <laughs> that's a good old slab of beef, boyfriend. eh, girls? And then, uh, and then they're like, oh, you should go talk to him. And then they're like, no, he has to come talk to me. But he has no idea that you're even interested. In fact, he's looking at you and like, wow, out of my league. Well, Gonna stay away from her. you know, it depends on the girl as well. Like, some girls will... You're telling me individuals are individual? <laughs> How dare you assume that? <coughs> that is what oh I'm saying. Oh my, who was that? Who do you think? I wasn't looking. It could be either one of you, actually. Georgia? It was George. It I'm was telling. literally was it really? Kyle. I think, so I think it was you. <laughs> I think it was you, Georgia. It was me. Okay, good. I know it was. Yeah, because you saw it happen. Don't George. Tell Doc <laughs> V that I burped into the mic. Oh, he, he's, my germs and He's going to be on, on your ass. Yeah, basically. Stop slamming the table. God, Mark. My hand's raised. Do you think I won't fucking do it I again? I think you will. I just don't want Doc V to come back in here. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. He can see me. He can't see you. He's, he's, he's not even Well, he's up. facing the wrong he's way. He's in there now. I, I saw. I found this app through a friend. It's, uh, it's designed in such a way where the girl has to make the first move. Oh, really? Yep. What app is it called? It's called Bumble. Oh. Because we're bum, bum fucking bum fuckling around, you oh, know? Oh, God. Bumbling <laughs> around. <laughs> Georgia. Oh, 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 God. Oh, oh God. God. Yeah, oh, no thanks. Oh, God. I thought Bumble was like a grinder type thing. I, th- I thought it was just for like Not to my knowledge. That's fine, I guess. You know what you should try? Grinder. Christian Mingle. Oh. Black Farmer's Meat. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a no? Meat. <sighs> They're meat. Meat. As in M. Double E <laughs> T. No, I thought you meant M E A T. Black farmers <laughs> meat. Oh my! <laughs> Big black. Hey. Whoa! Oh wait. my God, yeah, man! Let's what was the difference in what I just said and what he just said? Tell me that. I said meat as in double E as in normal meat. Like let's meet each other, and you said meat as in dong. I said meat. You feel me, dog? But you guys didn't have a problem with it until I said cock. Because you said <laughs> big, black, <laughs> dangus. You all seen Hateful Eight? I have. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. Oh, Thank you. God. Made him suck my big, oh, black, okay. dangus. dangus. Okay. Uh. We are going to move on. I love that movie. No, so I'm... after having this conversation, oh, though, wow. are you going to pursue t- Tinder? I don't know. That's fair. What about you, Mark? No. Yeah. That's Tinder not sucks. the kind of guy I am. I don't know. We'll see. I have it downloaded. I just haven't. I like clicked it once. And I was like, I got scared and I turned it off. <laughs> You're like, ah, women. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, it was like, put your phone number down. I was like, <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> would it be worse if they're like, we know what your phone phone number is. Would that be worse for you if they knew it already? Probably would be. Okay, that's fair. Uh, it's like what happened earlier when I had the writing, uh, the writing meeting, the yeah. writing center in the library. And you were late? I was late, and it was at 12.30, and somehow my phone started ringing, like a alarm was going off. I was like, what the fuck? I, didn't, I don't have anything he going on He looks at today. me at 12.32 and goes, oh, I'm late. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, 
it's like beeping around like it, like a, a what's it called a <sighs> reminder. And uh, I'm yeah. like, I didn't set that reminder. So Austin B somehow mm-hmm. got into my calendar on my phone and set a reminder for me. <laughs> what? And you still? I'm dead and, ass. And, I, I don't. You're, and you were still late. Austin B didn't do that. I don't know how that happened, but that wasn't Austin. Probably because him, he has a goddamn. I gave Samsung. him my phone number. That's why. Oh, that's not how. That's it how works. they were able to do it. Just remind you. I don't think it's over. No, it was on my calendar. No. Uh, <laughs> leave him alone. He's very stressed. I know you are. Tell me the next fucking topic. What? Tell me the next fucking topic. I feel like we should have put the, like, what's the best order for this list to go in? Just next one. Spider-Man. Spider-Man. Spooderman. <laughs> Spooder. Ah, where'd you get your license? The cereal box? Uh, oh, it's the Spider-Man. We need to stop. <laughs> Give me my notebook back. Oh, my God. I need my notes. Get your notes, fella. Get your notes. He's got his notes. Thank you. Okay, so <laughs> it's like J. Jonah Jameson in the third movie. It's oh, like God. you tell my wife. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, okay. So I have been trying to get Kyle to finish Spider-Man PS4 since week one of this fucking podcast, and I finally beat it. A he finally days ago. beat it, and it's been out for like four months. Been out since September seventh. August, September, October. No, four months. Wait, we're in October. No, months, it came months. out in September. Yeah, I'm saying. It. So it's September, and it's October, so it's only really been two months. Are you serious? Yep. Well, point is, he finally finished that bitch, and we're going to talk about it. I am really excited to talk about this with you because uh, in Georgia, I know you haven't played it yourself. Yeah, I was just going to let you guys talk during this. But if well, I mean, if you want to actually you know, participate, and you listen. can just ask questions, and we'll explain it to ask you. Ask questions? I don't even know what to ask. <sighs> You'll, Whatever. It'll come to you while we're talking. Okay, Kyle, so I feel like we should go, like, non-spoiler, just a general thing. feel, and then we'll go further in once it gets to that time. As we do. As as we do. Do you want to start? Since it's fresh sure. on your mind. Yeah, uh, so spoiler-free, what, uh, ooh, um, I'll put a time code in the description. Okay. Um, I actually broke it up into a list of things I loved, what I want to see more of, and things I didn't like. Cool. So, I saw um, your notes. Oh, yeah, you did, I guess. I'll start out with the things I loved very generally. Loved Peter Parker, obviously. Uh, he's the best version of Spider-Man in any medium, in my opinion. Mm-hmm. I, don't, I don't see... A, I've not experienced a better Spider-Man. Amen. And Peter Parker. Uh, he's about eight years into his ten years Spider-Man, so he's... I like... And I, and I kind of went into this last week a little bit. Mm-hmm. Um, I really mm-hmm. like this more confident Spider-Man. He's uh, He's not... He's still dorky and weird, but but he knows what he's, he's doing. Pretty dorky. He's been doing this for a while. He kind of knows uh, what's going on with everything. Is in his first ro- rodeo. It as they sure might say. is not. Sure and, ain't. And um, I just love that. I really like that. Like he knows. He he's grown. He's a, he's a he's a older guy. He he knows um, you know how to be responsible and things like that for the most part. Um. <laughs> so I loved Peter Parker, but two other characters, which I did not expect to love as much as I did, Miles Morales and um, MJ mm-hmm. in the game. Holy hell, they were great! Yeah, they were. They were so good. I love. I just. I don't know. Just every scene with Peter and MJ was just amazing. It was so much fun. They're so great together. It is. It's it's just great. And probably my favorite scene in the game, which I won't I won't get into here, but it involves Miles and Peter, and it's just sweet. It's so lovely. It's just so good. Miles. I don't know the the guy who voice acts him. He 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 sounds familiar to be honest, but I up. I don't know. Um, he's just just such, such a great job. Such a good job. Like, and I'm not a big Miles fan. Like, I never have been because I've never really seen him in anything. Up to like my Spider-Man knowledge was very limited mm-hmm. until I started playing this game, and then I was like, "Holy hell, this dude's awesome!" Like, I knew he was in it, and I knew everybody wanted Donald Glover to play him in Homecoming, but that didn't make any sense because Donald Glover's like 35, and Miles is supposed to be younger than Peter. He's playing his uncle. His uncle. Yeah, uh, in Spider-Man Homecoming, oh. he's playing Miles Morales' uncle. Okay. Who is the Prowler in the comics. He's a Spider-Man villain, I think. Oh, mm-hmm. okay. Well, I can get down with that. He I can. like that. He was in the first movie, though. Who Her- was? 
Donald, Donald Glover, Glover of like the new Spider-Man. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, I didn't know that was his uncle. Mm-hmm. I didn't either. His uncle. That's, I thought he was just. He says, "I've got a nephew that lives here." He's referring to Miles. Yeah, to Miles. Yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. But yeah, when they were like, "Oh, Donald Glover's gonna play," I was like, "Why? That doesn't make any sense." <laughs> He's like 35. <laughs> if he wanted to voice Miles, okay, I can get down with that, mm-hmm. maybe. But maybe he does. He. He's like thirty. I don't anyway. He's taller than than Tom Holland. <laughs> Ex- exactly. Like, uh, yeah. He's a whole man. He's a whole man. Tom Tom Holland is a whole fetus. He's. <laughs> I love him, but he's a whole baby boy. He is a baby. Let me tell you. Did you hear that? St- I'm sorry to. I, I, I know you're talking. Please. But uh, uh, after the Avengers four wrap, they all went out for like drinks, and Tom Holland looked so young they wouldn't let him get any. He's he, twenty two. Yeah, he's, he's but old they though. wouldn't let him get any because he looks like a child. So Chris. Thor Hemsworth had to buy him drinks <laughs> because no one would <laughs> give him any. That's yeah. great. Wait, Avengers 4 is the new one, right? It's yes, coming out pretty correct. soon. Mm-hmm. Infinity War Part 2. We don't have a name yet. So I say Annihilation, Endgame. I think Endgame would be a really good title or Annihilation. I, I really like Annihilation. I don't like Endgame. Because en- Endgame makes it feel like like that Spy Kids movie. Like the MCU is done. <laughs> God yeah. damn it. Sp- yeah. Spy Kids 3. Makes me feel like Game this over. is Wreck-It Ralph or something. Wreck-It Ralph. I, you guys have talked me out of it. I prefer Annihilation. See, yeah. good. It's, it's fun. But like the last Avenger, I don't like that. Doesn't make any sense. It's like there's a lot of Avengers. There's a fuck ton. Yeah. The last, and it's too close to the last Jedi. And oh, yeah. And Cap's first movie was the first Avenger, so it wouldn't really make any sense. Yeah. They're going to go with Annihilation. Definitely will. I don't see why they wouldn't. Thanos strikes again. <laughs> but if they call it Infinity War Part, Part Two, two I'm I don't think they would. Flip. They won. I don't think they hide the title for that long. If it was just Infinity War Part Two, yeah, because it it, w- it was supposed to be. Because when this was first announced, it was a hey, Inf- Infinity War is one big movie, but cut into two pieces. So it was announced as Part One, Part Two. Then they took Part One out, and they like, oh, Part Two doesn't exist. So I don't feel why they would hide it. Yeah, because Infinity War. Two. The one that came out, part one, I guess. I'm just going to call it part one for yeah. simplicity's sake. Uh, is a complete movie. Correct. Like, it does not feel like... I mean, I know, obviously, like, it's not done. And I know that because I know how Marvel movies work. Mm-hmm. But if I was just watching that movie, I would just be like, oh, the spoilers. Thanos won. Okay. That's the end of the movie. This is it. Cool. Roll credits. I'm sad. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. I'm, that really sucks. I don't know what they're going to do now, but he's won. He did what he set out to do. Correct. So, I don't know. Were we course, talking about Spider Man? We were. Uh, next yeah. thing I liked about Spider Man, um, they made a comic book thing exciting. Mm. And what I mean by that is, um, as much as I like the Marvel movies, I know exactly pretty much where they're gonna go. Like when they announced like this whole Captain uh, Marvel thing, I I know the beats that they're gonna hit. Mm-hmm. You know, it's the same as every other first. Uh, Marvel characters movie, you know, it's gonna he's gonna show their origin. They're gonna get their powers, you know. They're gonna there's gonna be something about them they have to overcome to become this character that they are in the comics, um, and then they're gonna be fight some big bad guy, and they're not gonna die because this is only their first movie, and they're contracted for at least sixty seven of them, <laughs> and uh, thirty nine uh, collaborations with other superheroes. So they're not going to die, and they're going to, you know, that's just the way it is. That's, that's how they work. That's and just the way it is. I almost don't blame them because, like, the formula they have, it feels like it's the only way it can work. But Correct. <laughs> DC's this, ass. <coughs> yeah, Sorry, I agree. Yeah, some, I agree. Some my throat. So bad. Yeah, they rushed it, man. They just took their time. Their third movie was Justice League. Whose fucking idea was that? Yeah, I don't even know who the Justice like who these Justice Leaguers are. Like, I know who the Justice League is, That's but I, know I don't know. I'm like, who are these characters? Why we've should all, I care? Yeah, we've 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 only met Superman. I guess he's yep. the only one that had his full movie, but before that, and that was a decent movie. Wonder Woman. I really Man like of Steel. Man of Steel was bad. good. I, I I like it. Soundtrack's really really good too. It's very good. Yeah, yeah all those drums and shit. That's it's like cool. all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then Batman's like, "Hey, guys, I'm here now. This is me." Yeah, this is my movie now. I, I I'm sh- taking half the billing. I shoot people in this movie. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. We're anyway, talk about it. Uh, but yeah, this Spider-Man made things exciting because they didn't do all of the typical Spider-Man things. It's not an origin story. Like I said, he's been doing this for like eight years. So we don't have to see Uncle Ben. He's mentioned very briefly. Thank God that bastard's already dead. Thank God. <laughs> 
the only character in comic book history who is dead, dead, like will not come back. Oh, yeah. Um. So yeah, I, I just it, it Batman's parents. Oh well, yeah, that's true. I didn't think about that. Um. But yeah, it, it just made things exciting. What? You, what? Superman's whole planet. <laughs> Well, okay, it's fine, worse, guys. Boys. I don't read much comic. Sorry. Re- read many comic. I don't read many comic. <laughs> I don't read much comics. Uh, but yeah, so I uh, uh, I love how they made it exciting. Like, they do things. They don't tell the same old stories of Spider-Man that I've seen before, you know? Uh, they don't immediately shoot their load with Venom. You know, he's not in the game. Boom. Uh, anyway. You might as well. Just <laughs> uh, can we get into the spoilers, I guess? No, nope, because you need to do yours too. I'm sorry. Okay, fair. Okay, no, sorry. Okay, yeah. Well, I'll be quick. I'm just telling you, Venom's not in the game. Correct. Wink. Was that your overall thing? No, it's not. Oh my god. I'm not done yet. Oh, boy's got more notes. Okay, but yeah, uh, so we'll get into more of that. Uh, it subverted expectations correctly, which is a topic I think that, it, and we'll get more into this during the spoilers, mm-hmm. but it subverted expectations the correct way, in my opinion. Uh, and the last thing I really loved in it was Doc Ock. Oh, yeah. I really don't think you, there's really much else to say about that. He's just incredible. He's in the great, game. In the, great in this. He's so good. Uh, things I wanted to see more of, Silver Sable, didn't do much in the game. I'm glad with that. I didn't like Raxen all the time. It was kind of aggravating. It was weird. Uh, and I didn't like how she like only had two pistols and a lab coat. Is she powered? I don't know. I don't understand. Because she's doing flips and hints I don't know a thing mouth. about her. Neither do I. I understand why Sable was in the game, mm-hmm. but I don't understand why Silver Sable was in the game. If because you, she's a Spider-Man thing and she she had to be in there, I guess. It would have been cool if we got like little like hints of her, but like, okay, Sable's here, but Silver Sable is not because she's like, I got better shit to be doing right You're now right. than fucking around with Norman Osborn. Mm-hmm. So she's like, I got my own shit to do. You, I'll send you a little force to watch yeah. her back, you know, I think that would have been a little better. Why uh, was she there? And just plant the seeds in a fucking trench coat. <laughs> in a tr- in a Every- white. Everybody else is wearing full body armor, and she's got two little dinky ass pistols in a trench coat. Yeah, that's oh, all she's got. God. And uh, yeah, and she keeps kicking Spider Man throughout the game in for the some m- reason. Mouth. Yeah, Even though she has guns. I'm just like, why do you keep doing that? Leave his mouth alone. But. I'm not saying I don't like her character. I like what they were... Go- I, I could see where they're going. It's just I want to see more. Correct. Okay. And the other thing I want to see more of, I can't say without spoiling it. So I, I will, know what it is. You I, wrote it down. Yeah. I seen it. I will save it. Cool. The things I did not like, I didn't like MJ and Miles' missions. I like them as characters. I did not like playing as them. Nobody does. I thought it was kind of bullshit. Every time it like faded to black in the middle of a cutscene, I was like, fuck. Here here's, we go. Here's fucking Miles again. Here we go. You gotta sneak around some boxes. Don't like, don't step on the glass. And then and, and then when you see the thing, it's like twenty minutes ago. I'm like, fuck. Oh, God. I don't wanna. Uh, I don't care what happened twenty minutes ago. And I understand what they were trying to do. Okay, I get it. I know what they were trying to just do. Just show it in a cutscene. They could have done that. I don't want to play it. I don't want to. And I don't. And there's a part towards the end of the game. Uh, okay, again, getting that spoiled. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, so yeah, didn't like that. Uh, the open world junk, wasn't a fan. Really? There was too much shit. I'm the complete, complete opposite. I like it as a person who likes checklists. Like, I'm like, ooh, got that done, got that done, got that, but it does not make a good game. Like, I would like something like The Witcher 3 where it's like very deep. Is that any good? Fuck yeah, dude. It's so good. I I, I haven't played it yet. Okay, just take 200 hours of your life and just dedicate it to that. Can't afford it. I got friends to watch. It's tough. You got... Oh, friends. Yes, I uh, Uh, started friends. I thought you meant like people. Oh, yeah. No, I I started friends and I I need to finish all of it soon. Oh, okay. Well... That's great. uh, But yeah, I I don't like all the open world junk. It feels like like a game that came out eight years ago. Did you collect all the backpacks? I did. How soon? As soon as they were available to me. me did you just go around and start doing them yep. all at once? Me too. <laughs> because the best thing about the game is web swinging, right? Mm-hmm. And all the backpack collecting is is web swinging. Correct. Just getting to these backpacks. So why wouldn't I? You know? That's fair. Oh, and the other, the last thing I didn't really care for were the suits. They were kind of really? they were kind of hyped up, and I was severely let down by the suits that were available. Most to me. Most of them I didn't like. Yeah, that's yep. Mm-hmm. Because. The first suit you get in the game with the white spider is the best suit in the game, look wise, uh, in my opinion. You're wrong. <laughs> Except for maybe the very last suit that you get as part of the campaign. Yeah, that might that kind of gives it a run. I like some of them. I like 
Well, we'll get into it. Yes, sir. Okay. So give me your overview. Spoiler free, bud. Spoiler free overview. Spider Man PS4. I fucking love this game. It's great. It's great. It's a good Uh, game. uh, They actually dropped an update today for New Game Plus. Oh, so if you finish, you can go go back with all your su- suits and your skills, and I probably won't. Whatever, but it's good to know. <laughs> I probably won't either. But no, I I love the open world stuff. I get why it's in it. Everything I think has a purpose. Like the uh, challenges are fun are fun to do, and you get tokens, you can get your suits. The They're fi- hard. They are hard. They're pretty I beat, difficult. I beat them all. I didn't gold them all, but I golded a few. Oh, it's fucking impossible. Those drone ones are dog shit. I by know. The way. <laughs> I don't. I don't know how I you're supposed like to get them. gold. Like. I don't get how you're it makes you to better get gold at, on those. at like swinging. I get why, but it's so difficult. It would be more useful if they let the blue little orbs you have to run through like ahead, because like I've gotten to points where I'm like I'm right behind the drone. I don't know where the next blue orb. So you have to oh, stay on his there. ass. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. I'm like, oh, it's back there. Shit, uh, I gotta no. turn around, and you just at that point I just restart. But I'm I, I'm gonna do this on spoilers. But the guy who gives you those challenges, right? The first time I met him, he beat my ass. <laughs> We're he, my, get me, me too. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I think that was supposed to happen. I don't think so. I've seen people beat it on their first try before. For real? And he fucked me. He kicked me. my ass, dude. I, I was like, "How do I beat up dead?" All right. He he he. I just... thought and I I thought it would restart the fight. Nope, you're just in an alley, crippled somewhere. Yeah, he he like slid under your legs and kicked you in the back. <sighs> I was Jackass. like, "Damn." But no, uh, I like the open world stuff. I like the backpacks. Every time you get it. There's a small little new like soundbite about something from his past. I, I did like and, that. And I, I listen to all of those. It's just fun, like world building stuff that I really dig. Uh, combat, I liked a whole lot. Combat if, is really combat good. is really, if you like the uh, the Arkham games. Every, everyone says it's basically like that, but but it is. It's different. But it's better because it's because v- you can fight vertically. Yeah. Batman, the Arkham games is on the ground. You're there, but Spider Man, you can go up and left up. You can you know you can. Web and shit. I'm doing a lot of things with, with my with my hands right, yeah, right now. <laughs> I see it and I like it. <laughs> Thank you, man. But, but no, uh, this is probably one of the better Spider-Man stories that have been that has been told recently in a while. In a while, uh huh. It's definitely. It's been a kick-ass year for PlayStation. Exclusives. Oh yeah, X- Xbox can die. <laughs> it's just like you got God of War, which I still think is better than Spider-Man, but I, I do love Spider-Man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I know you don't. Yeah, but, <laughs> uh, I still think it's better, but. Uh, Spider-Man is really, really good. What has Xbox had this year? Nothing. Forza Horizon? I don't give a shit. <laughs> They've had literally nothing I can name. Yeah. And I have an Xbox. So. I sold mine to get Spider-Man on my... Really? PlayStation. Yeah. I went in with my, X- with my Xbox. My Xbox, all my games, all my gear, I'm like, take it from me. I don't need it. Was it worth it? Yeah! <laughs> Fuck Xbox! Jeez. But no, I, I uh, this, the suit stuff that you were talking about, I like the We're going to dip into spoilers now. That's not a spoiler, is it? I, I know, but like, I okay, figure we... Cause our, our, yeah, we're going to dip... Yeah, we're, we're good. We're okay. going to dip Dipping into, into spoilers, spoilers and Georgia, for the love of God, feel free to say... <laughs> anything. Anything at any point. I feel like I just... I feel like you should speak some more <laughs> than you are. I was just listening. I know you are, but... I just don't have anything to add, so... Well, you if, guys talk. We'll be quick so we can get back to stuff, you know... No, it's fine. No, we won't. We won't be quick. <laughs> We're gonna talk about this for the next hour. Hour and a half. Uh, anyway, so spoilers starting now. Doc Ock, holy shit! What a man! I didn't know he was in this when I first bought the game. I had no idea. I didn't either because I stayed away from trailers and He's stuff. He's not even in any of them. He's not. He's not advertised at all. Okay, cool. I yeah, like that. I went in. and I'm like, is that who am I working for? Oh, Otto. Otto Octavius. <laughs> is that and, you? <laughs> and and I thought they were gonna like save him for like. A, over a couple games, you're gonna see him yeah. turn slowly into Doc Ock, no, it which was I think would have been better, honestly. Maybe, but you don't put Doc Ock and not make him Doctor Octopus. Yeah, mm. you don't. Mm. It's like, oh, it's like, oh, here's Eddie Brock, but he's not Venom yet. Like they wouldn't do that. Yeah, they wouldn't, and they're not going to. <laughs> no, they won't. Because For another reason, which we'll talk about. Some, some, we'll wait on it. Yeah, but he's uh, all over the place. But Doc Ock, my favorite Doc. Well, we only really have one Doc Ock, which is the so Spider-Man Two. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What, what, what was the actor's name? Uh, I don't know. Something <laughs> Mali. Mal, uh, yeah, it's something Molina. Yeah. Yeah, and yeah. he's amazing. He's great. He's. I. I still think I prefer him in general as Doc Ock, but I think you can't go wrong with. I like one. his. Uh, Relationship with his arms a bit more in Spider Man Two. Yeah, well, he has they like were no, kind of in yeah. his head, and he could kind of like hear them talk a bit. Exactly, mm-hmm. that was fun. Um, 
but I do like the Doc Ock in the game because he he looks like the comic book. Oh yeah, version. big fat those fucking Ugly. dumb goggles. Yeah, <laughs> wearing a welder suit, <laughs> jumpsuit. It's just ridiculous. But when you're fighting him at the end of the game, it's terrifying. He, he's intimidating. He's scary. Those yeah. tentacles are scary as fuck. Yes. Remember when you're in the lab and you're testing because uh he makes his arms because he's uh he's losing his brain is giving out and he's losing function to his muscles right yeah so he's starting it out as like a prosthetic and you do the little test where the hand has to pick up a glass or something he starts like juggling balls juggling yep and a ball goes away and you see the hand kind of stretch out into tentacles i'm like oh god yeah i saw that i was like oh oh (laughs) shit like like, this is where we're going that was i was like oh that was terrifying i I didn't make the connection when that scene happened i was like until that scene happened i mean me too uh, because i was like oh we're just working on robotics okay that makes sense yeah yeah. like i didn't even make the connection that he's working on then the hand became a tentacle i was like oh god (laughs) oh okay cool and I really liked that a lot. And oh, yeah. the last when you're fighting him at the end on the on the on the rooftop of Oscorp, that's terrifying. He, he's fucking scary he's tall looking. As shit. Like his arms are giant. Like I feel like they don't like they don't stop growing. Like yeah. they keep on getting bigger. <laughs> yeah, as the fight goes on, he's just larger and larger. <laughs> I'm like, why do you look like a daddy long leg? <laughs> the first time that you see him with with the arms, he's with Peter cuz he he, he he doesn't give a shit. He walks because he's fucking with his mind. And he walks in. And you're in the lab, so it's small and there's a roof. He's terrifying. Yeah. The sound that just him clumping down on the floor, I'm like, he's going to fucking kill me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, for sure. And I just, I guess I didn't realize how impressive those arms were. Because, really I mean, impressive. like, I know his real, Doc Ock's real power is his mind, mm-hmm. obviously. He's a genius. But, uh, and he's a bad guy, so that's a scary combination. Correct. But, those arms, I wouldn't fuck with those arms. Oh no, I I I have no idea because this but this version of him even more so. I have no idea what those arms are, are capable of now. No, I don't either. Mm-mm. And I feel like it's whatever the plot requires, to be which honest. is fine. Which is fine. Because this one's a machine gun. Wait a minute. <laughs> because the arms are fucking terrifying. I don't know. And when he starts beating your ass at the end with the arms and like crushing your head on like a car. Oh yeah. I'm like fuck. Dude. His head is like, dead. Just. Also, his arm is stabbed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. That, that looked that. like it hurt. I'm going to tell you, when they fight on the side of the building, like the very last aspect of the final fight, uh-huh. kick ass, dude. That's so much fun. great fight. It's so cool. It makes sense that they'd be fighting on the side of a building. What else would they be doing? You're right. Two spider, they're both not spider based, but two, you know, sticky based yep. people. Well, they kind of are like spiders. They're like spiders. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, Doc Ock was amazing. And the suit you get, the suit Peter builds. What is it called? Uh, the anti ox suit. <laughs> oh, killer. <laughs> ah, ock. Operation uh, Ock Destruction. Oh God. That scene uh, that where Peter and Ock are in the building together after the fight, heartbreaking scene. <laughs> God bless you. Thank you. Yeah, bless I agree. You. That's a great scene. It is. It's really sad. And he's like, because uh, I know. Don't do his voice. <laughs> well, no. No, <laughs> <laughs> no uh, n- because I'm trying to think of it. Like. Is Ock kind of like that in the comics where he kind of like tries to toy with Peter's emotions a little bit like that? I don't know what main comic Doc it, Ock is like right now. I oh god, because it felt like it was he oh was manipulating. <laughs> it felt like he was manipulating him a little bit in this one. Yeah, like he was kind of doing a like a oh you know huh, I'm not like that a bad. wool over the sheets type. Yeah, wool over the that's eyes. what he was doing. And wool then he the he'd like walk up close and give him a hug and then he'd give stab, a stab. Him, <laughs> stab him with a. Well, peanut the, butter. The the knife. what was happening with his mind was messing with his brain, and the tentacles were doing worse things to his brain, right? Like mood changes. Yeah, yeah. So maybe that maybe bipolar. He's, maybe maybe, he's, maybe, he's, maybe he's, he's not playing with him. At that point, though, when they were in the building together, he'd gotten oh, his oh, thing off. Right. I, I think at, at that point in time, yeah, absolutely. But I I wonder how much of that was legit. Feel sorry emotion. for me, Peter. Don't leave me in jail. My legs don't work. Ah. <laughs> exactly. <That's> a, <laughs> that, Georgia, if you're wondering, that's literally. That's his that is in the that script. I read it <laughs> verbatim. That is exactly I re- what I wrote it. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, oh, I'm Peter, my legs. It's <laughs> exactly what uh, happened. Okay, uh, the rest of the six, the sinister six. I don't think they're called that in in your. No, he did they're refer not called to that as yet. The six. Yeah, I don't like their fights as much. I didn't either. I like they the were Vulture like, and Electro fight. That was cool. But that's it. Because you were s- using the web swinging. You never hit the ground during that f- that fight. Or you the, shouldn't have. You shouldn't know. And the Rhino fight is kind of garbage. The Scorpion Rhino fight is dog shit. Yeah. 
I kept dying. Well, because yeah, because because Scorpion would shoot poison. He would at hit you. you with the poison that's that's slowed you down, and then Rhino would. Just, yeah, it wasn't good. Just take care of you. He would take you to town. Yeah, pound town. And I I wasn't a big fan. And I wasn't a big fan. Of, like they were nowhere near as interesting as Doc Ock. No, they didn't have any character, and that's fine. I don't care. So, and the uh, Mister Negative. Mister Negative, which is I got you, my <laughs> alias. Oh, if you didn't know, because you're always so goddamn negative. Yep. Oh. Fair enough. I'm not that negative. You're not that negative, man. I'm all right. How's your week been, Kyle? What? Did we just time travel? No, but Deja every, vu. you're so negative. I'm not. What? Whenever we ask you about your week, you're just like, oh. I'm the you same. Know. It's, 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 it's whatever. <laughs> I have a problem. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but anyway, so your arms are talking to me. No, it's actually just Mark in your headphones. <laughs> Kyle, do a thing. The hearts are talking. Do a thing. <laughs> Kyle, do a thing. Kyle, do a flip. Okay. <laughs> I'll do it. <laughs> Stop asking me. Uh, but anyway, yeah, I thought the rest of Sinister Six, I wasn't, didn't really care about them all that much. I like their outfits, though. Yeah, look good. Their designs were very cool. They look nice and comic booky. Nice and sleek. I like how it's all armor. Yeah. Like, none of it is a dumb rubber suit. Except for Shocker. Shocker can get fucked. <laughs> yeah, he's just wearing a leather jacket. Uh, I like his helmet, though. Did he wear the helmet? Yeah. At any point? Shocker wore it the whole time. Not Electro. I'm talking about Shocker. The one you fight in the bank? Fuck! I yeah. thought they were the same! They're different people. Did they have the exact same powers? Uh, Shocker is vibration-based, and Electro has actual powers. Like He's the only one of the six that actually has powers. Right. Yeah, everyone else is just like, I'm big, I have a suit, you know. Okay. Vulture's case, I have cancer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which is really, I didn't know that about him. I think that's why he makes the suit. Yeah. But in this version, the suit gives him cancer. Yeah. What a time to be alive. What a... Old Adrian Toomes. <sighs> Ye old man. But anyway, uh, I actually love how Doc Ock got them all to work with him. He was like... Because they're terrified of him. I would be too. And he offered to help him out in, yeah, in some he, way. Yeah, he, he'd but be it was, like... But it was also like, hey, I will help you, but at the same time, I'll kill you if you don't do what I want. Because mm-hmm. Have you seen I'm, these arms? Because I'm 15 feet tall and terif- terrifying. Right. <laughs> Have you seen these, these arms? Have you seen he's, these he's arms? He's talking about like his actual arms, like flexing. You see these arms? <laughs> hey, Rhino, <laughs> check out these motherfuckers, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually really hysterical watching him with these like badass arms. It's just this limp rag doll like, in the center I of it. I don't with- like whenever he use, like he, he doesn't use his own feet. Like he uses the the arms to propel himself. I'm like, why are you doing this to yourself? Because he's just like it's dangling. Like just there. <laughs> Where's like your Bob's respect, six. Otto? As a self respect, use a street like everybody else. Octavius. God, Otto. God. But no, I like the suits in this game a lot. They're really good. I I know you don't, but I like the more armor looking suits. Yeah, I, I like, like the those. sleek armor. Like, looks like you can take a hit. I don't like the claw. I don't give a fuck about claw suits. Like, uh, the Spider Armor Mark II, which was the black and, and and gold one. That was my first buy. It was a good one. The, uh, you mean the Iron Spider? No, no, no. It's, it was called uh Ar- Spider Armor Mark. II. It was like gold. It was it was mostly black, and the finishes were like gold, like around the eyes and the chest. I don't remember that one. Well, you're wrong. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I'm t- I, I, I believe it's there. I Thank just, you. I don't think I've seen it. I don't know. Anyway. Give me a second. I didn't like the suits because I thought they were kind of stupid looking. Okay, yeah. Yeah, See? I know what you're talking okay, about. Cool. All right. Uh, I didn't like that. Uh, I didn't like suits like that because I'm like, Peter Parker is poor, and there is no way in hell he's able to afford to build actual armor. That's fair. And the first suit you get has a little bit of armor on it, the white, but that was mostly Ock stuff, though. That was mostly stuff that he Ock gave built to that him. for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. It's a, uh, it's just like ceramic, like hard material. It's not armor. It's just like harder than mm-hmm. the rest of his suit. But the rest of it's like cloth. Correct. And that's always just been more Spider-Man to me because I wasn't picking my suits based on what made sense from a story standpoint. I'm like, shit, this looks fucking cool. But even then, like I thought the ones I was seeing looked awful. Like, like I didn't. Okay, so. What was your favorite suit besides the ones that, that you're given in 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 the, in the game? Uh, Scarlet Spider. Ben Riley. Yeah, I like with that his one. sweater. I liked that one a <laughs> his lot. His cut off sweater. <laughs> yeah, I liked it. I thought it was cool. I'm gonna pull it up for Georgia just so she knows. Yeah, it was neat. Ben Riley. You know the suit you get for collecting all the backpacks? 
dog shit. The worst waste of my fucking time. Game. Oh my god, <laughs> it's awful. It's the worst. It's the first shoot you get. <laughs> it's cool, I like isn't that. it? That is. It's just like cut off sweater. Yeah, but he's got like little things and. I do, I do like his web shooters in that. Yeah. Yeah. It looks, it looks like like. But no, you spend twenty four hours getting all the fucking backpacks, and it's the homemade suit from Homecoming, which is the worst one. <laughs> <laughs> it's disgusting. It's somehow worse than the suit he wrestles in. <laughs> That's better. The one you get. It looks like you're just wearing a sweater. Because you are. <laughs> Oh my god. You're not god. even wearing gloves at that point. Like, no. I actually would be curious. And you're wearing like jogging pants too and like sneakers. <laughs> like I'd actually be curious to see what that looks like in cutscenes. There's this one suit where he's wearing just like jeans and like a jacket. I like that one. I don't. It's it's neat. I, I, I like, I like the uh, noir suit because he has a gun on him. I don't because he has a gun on him. You see, there, I mean, there's a pattern that, here. I mean, but that Spider-Man does have a gun on him. Right, but this Peter does not. This Peter also isn't the Spider-Man from the MCU, so why would you wear this? I, I don't like that suit in, in this game at all. The Stark suit? Yeah, I don't. I don't think it makes sense. I wore it for a few minutes, and I was like, It looks nah. weird, because this Spider-Man is a grown man, and that suit was made for a child. Yeah, for a boy. For a boy. Plus, I think the Iron Spider suit from the MCU looks like dog shit. Don't I like it. The gold gauntlets. There's too many different colors that aren't that don't work well. Yep. It's blue, red, and then gold. Yeah, why don't you just pick two colors? Just red and gold. Just make it red and gold. Sorry, it upsets me. Iron Man, Tony Stark. It was made by Tony. Why wouldn't it have his scheme? In the comics, it looks like an Iron Man suit, but it's just a spider. Have you seen the 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 one from the comic? Uh huh. Uh, like I'm Iron... being judged here. The Iron Spider suit. Yeah. Uh, you've showed it to me. Have I? I think so. It's cool as shit. But yeah, uh, so I was a fan. I I want to get into one thing in particular though that uh because. I, I didn't think we saw enough of Silver Sable. I think they were just kind of, oh, that's lit. Isn't it? That's badass. Oh, uh, that's really cool. Thank you. I like that. Um, I drew it myself. I didn't draw myself. That's better. Like, why would they even fuck exactly. with that? Uh, <laughs> Sorry. So, mm, excuse me. Um, I didn't think they did enough with Silver Sable. I know they were just kind of planting the seeds for that because I feel like she's going to play a more prominent role in the future games. Mm-hmm. Um. Because it, it, I mean, they started to work together at the end of the game, and she Plus, was like, not kicking his ass every Speeder time he saw her. I, I just called Spider Man Speeder because I, th- I mixed Spider Man <laughs> and Peter together. Speeder Man, <laughs> Speeder Sparker. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if they're a thing in comic books. I think Spider Man fucks whoever in the comic books because Black Cat, he's fucked. MJ, he's fucked. I wonder, if he's, Stacey, I wonder he's fucked. if he's fucked Black Cat in this game. Absolutely. You think? Yeah. Why do you think he's so like weird about her? Because they've bone. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. And MJ no, I don't know in this one. They, they might. But the thing with Black Cat is that she's more attracted to Spider Man than Peter, which makes no sense. That's odd. It is. She's got a mask fetish. She is a thing from yeah. She's a mask kink, which I guess is fine. It's I'm not gonna. It's okay. Judge you We're for not gonna it. get, in, it's get fine. into it. It's fine. <laughs> it just happens. She's hot, so she can be into whatever she, she is wants. Hot. I actually you don't see her in the game. You just hear her. Her uh. The story, the expansion with her comes out next week, actually. I'm not going to buy it. I bought the season pass. I'm going to buy Red Dead Redemption. You're just like a fucking normal person. Whoa! Uh, But anyway, (laughs) uh, so the other thing I wanted to talk about, and this is more spoiler territory, the thing that they didn't do uh, a whole lot with, but I understand why, and I really look forward to it, is Harry Osborn. Oh, shit. Is Venom. In this universe. Or we think. We, it makes the most sense. It makes the most sense because uh, in the game, he's gone to Europe. I thought he was on like a, a college thing. Me like, too. Like, like, like I thought oh, he was yeah. just studying abroad. Mm-hmm. And uh, then they were like, oh, no, he just went to Europe. And I was like, okay. It, it said he's that, rich, uh, I guess that he didn't sense. tell anybody. He just kind of left. He didn't say bye. Yeah, he just went away. He's been gone for a few months or years. And, it, and they, they were like... and. Peter and MJ were just like, oh, cool, that's Harry, you know. This is my friend, there he goes. And then I thought that was kind of odd how neither of them were kind of, like, pissed about that. Like, or didn't why- check up on him. Yeah, and, like, they were kind of like, yo, why the fuck did he just leave? <laughs> like, I don't like My that. best friend since childhood. Just left. Just skedaddled. Didn't say anything. No, sir. Uh, And then he's like, yeah, I guess I'll help you with your research stations, Harry. That was sweet, though. Yeah, it was nice. I helped my little pal out. I'll yeah, it was well, for I his mom. It's, it's more for his mom. Yeah, which is still cool. Which is cool. 
Yeah, I agree. Uh, hey, Peter, I know you're you're not Spider Man, but these stations they they require you to swing through gas clouds. So if you could just figure <laughs> it out, I guess. Also, catch this pigeon, like Harry. <laughs> Unless he knew, he <laughs> unless was he knew, it feels like everybody in the game knew he, who Spider Man yeah. was. It's like Aunt May at the end of the game. I'm, I'm sp- <laughs> wait. Let me see my nephew. <laughs> I'm like, oh, yeah. I'm in, like, in, in in this one, Aunt May dies. Yeah, she does. at the end, she eats it. Just eats it very slowly, very painfully. I don't know. It's a it's a horrible death. It's a good choice by by Peter though. That's a that's a really hard choice that he had to I, make. And okay, this and we're gonna. I'm gonna just get into it now. <laughs> uh, this is probably one of my favorite things about when, when I said it subverted expectations correctly. Okay, Last Jedi did it wrong because it just took the thing you thought should happen and Here just did the opposite. Okay, and that's all I'm gonna say about the Last Jedi. <laughs> that's all I got. Okay. Okay. And okay. Infin- and uh, Luke was a piece of shit. No, <laughs> <laughs> Luke was a fuck. <laughs> um. So, but yeah, and then, uh, but this game did it correctly because it you expect made to live right mm-hmm. but it makes sense that she would not because in the situation that was put in in the situation she was put in her character was built in such a way that she would sacrifice herself for a bunch of people mm-hmm. you know and it's good for peter it helps his arc too because he learns a le- he learns another lesson through another uh parental figure dying another parental figure dying and the one we don't expect he's got know? nobody now he's got nobody he's got mj he's got miles and that's it. He can't have Harry any anymore. That's going to be bad in the next game. Yeah, I look forward to it. It Me looks too. good. It, I feel it like looks that's really a really cool. good path to take with Venom and with Harry is to make him Venom. You know, them. Yeah, yeah. I think that'd be really fun for them. Um, okay, not fun for them, but fun for us to see. Yeah, what fun, fun for us to see it mm-hmm. on the screen. Um, but yeah, I I just I really liked that because they they figured out a way to make. I don't want to say they made May relevant because she always was relevant. You yeah, know, yeah, yeah. she was always that. Just I liked her more in this one a lot. She I did fun. too. I did too she because it didn't. It felt like she actually did stuff. You know, like she ran the little organization. She was always helping. Peter, have some money. <laughs> yeah, and then in the original trilogy, she she just did nothing but complain. It felt and like. yell yell at Peter about some about some shit and give him twenty dollars. Yeah. It's not that much. Take my ring. You're gonna die in five months, lady. Who gives a fuck? God, <laughs> Jesus I'll just Christ. take. I'll just take ring. it when when you die. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man! God. But in this one, yeah, it was like okay, so you're used to seeing Uncle Ben die in Spider-Man things, right? Okay, well in this one we're gonna kill May, and it's not just gonna be because oh you you didn't expect that, did you? No, it actually makes sense in the story, and it helps Peter grow as a person, mm-hmm. which is ultimately what May's character is there for. Because when May got sick, I'm like, oh, she's gonna be fine, you know? This is Spider-Man. I did too. Call. I'm like, oh. May <laughs> as she's May. dying because it doesn't show it. Like it cuts to black, and then you hear the. Beep. I was like, oh, yeah. fuck. Yeah, they went there. I was like, damn. Because like, I saw her in the hospital bed, and she was like, she doesn't have a lot of time. <laughs> and, then, uh, 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 and then I was like, all right, cool. Let's go do the last mission, and then let's save May. Let's save May. All right, cool. Let's do it. And I then, only have this much of an- antidote. <laughs> like, just give her a little bit. Give her, give her a little bit. To give her bit. some time. Give her enough. <laughs> give her just a little bit to give her some time. He was going to down that whole bitch on her, too. Do you see? He was ready yeah. to put the whole thing in. <laughs> he didn't even hesitate. He was like, he well, he was like. He did hesitate. Well, he did hesitate, but like oh that first couple steps when she's like starting a flatline or whatever. He's, he's just oh like, God. boy. Ready. And, then, and then he stops, and he's like, uh. Uh, and then he doesn't do it and because she dies. that's what May taught him. It's a speed. That's I keep on saying speeder. Fuck. That's a nice. That's a Peter thing to do. That's the spirit of Spider Man in the spirit. That's the, that's the spirit of Speeder. That's the spirit of Speeder Man. I'll be here all day. Do you remember the movie The Spirit? Do you remember that spirit? Film? The, one, the one with the horse? No, the one with the. Sp- it's like black and white. It's got to do with the red. Tie. I know who you're talking about Spirit. The spirit. Samuel L. Jackson is in there. He is. Doesn't he play some guy he called plays the, the octopus? octopus? Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I remember that. Oh god, that's a lot. That's talking movie. about Spirit, like the one with the horse. I don't know a horse movie. What? I know what you're talking about. It's good. Yeah. You cry. There's an Indian boy in it. It's like Are a. Are you lad- crying right now? It's sad. <laughs> yeah. You know. You know what movie has the best ending? Oh, God. What's that? The Boy in the Striped Pajamas. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you got to define what best means to you, though, dog. I'm just kidding. Those damn Jewish people die. That's my yeah. best best ending. Yo, Schindler's List, girl. terrible movie. How dare they survive? <laughs> I saw a girl on, twi- er, on uh, <laughs> Twinder. I'm aware. On Twitter, post a picture of her in a striped shirt, oh, no. and her caption was Boy in the Striped 
pajamas. Oh, no. <laughs> God damn. So many people oh. went in on her ass for doing that. Did you know where you said? No, I just saw it on her Twitter. Her caption should have been like, hope I'm not, you know, on the way to the showers or something. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> that would have been better. Thank you. <laughs> that would have been really good. Thank you. I would have been a fan of that. <laughs> <laughs> Probably wouldn't have gone in as hard. Probably would have just clapped. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> Spider-Man PS4. G- game of the year. Game of the year. Not game of the year. Game of the year. No, sir. There's still uh, Red Dead. To God get of to. War isn't isn't as replayable as I feel Spider Man is. Well, because that map's too fucking big. I'm like, I don't care about God of War's not that big. Ruins. Yeah, it's fucking. Huge. It feels big, but because it, Spider Man's realistically bigger. Real. Oh, it's, oh yeah, yeah. Like square is. footage. Oh, he's realistically he's bigger. I tell you what, I bet bigger. I bet. I bet Kratos has a bigger dick than, than, than Spider Man. I bet though. Kratos has the biggest dick in all of history. Yeah, his he's, dick is just like. I mean, I, He's a god, so he could have like made it bigger, and then when he became not a god, it's just still giant. You know the females you fuck in those games? <laughs> I'm in aware. In the God of War games? Correct. They didn't live much longer, I don't think, after that. You, oh, no. Have you ever noticed that? Everyone he fucks ends up Dies. dying. Dies. I just... God dick. That's where I'm going to end it. Right there with that one. <laughs> god dick. Can that be the name of the next game? We can call this episode God Dick. We're calling it God Dick. Oh, God, God Dick. God. I need to start dick. naming them. So I went. I, I named five, and I want to go back and name the other ones. So it's not just egg in a bottle. Episode four. I'm like, do it. <laughs> <laughs> what did you name the other one? Sharp Rock. Sh- Sharp Rock. Oh. I thought it was Shaved Rock. Honestly, <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna name the one. Uh, I'm gonna name episode four. Uh, Touch it. It's cold. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, cold. It's cold. Oh, but that's, uh, that's still my favorite moment. Yeah, of no, all of it's the... because of my fucking laugh. And you keep so listening back to funny, dude. Oh, no. It's he, he, he just was like he pulled back, and there was, it was like <laughs> silent for a little bit, and then you just hear. <laughs> 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 and then he comes back, and, and then he tries to come back, and then he's like, <laughs> <laughs> and then you, yeah, you hear Georgia doing that. And like, it's so fucking That's me, funny, boys. dude. Wow, I loved it. Oh my god, it lasts my favorite. Thanks, man. It's the best thing. I don't like my love. Yeah, you should. Mm. You should own it because it's really good. That's okay. But uh, yeah, Spider Man was good. What a fucking good time. I enjoyed it quite a bit. What time we at? One six. What? One hour, seven minutes. Not as far along as I thought. All right. Okay. All righty. We have more topics for Let's you Let's get today. this shit in here, boys. <laughs> yeah, we sure do. We got more for you here. Uh, I, I just want to say one thing on Spider-Man PS4. Okay. Uh, I heard that this is the start of the Marvel gaming world. So how uh, Iron Man 1 was the beginning of the, MC, the MCU. Yeah, this, this is the beginning this is of This going to be the same thing. The MGU, the Marvel gaming <laughs> universe. Yeah. I just want to see how the versions of these other characters are. Can you imagine an Iron Man game? Oh, my fucking God. I'm coming right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> no, but if all the Spider-Man characters are different in some way, imagine how the how, the, how everybody else is and their villains and how different like they are. Like we said, Tony Stark is a paraplegic. Wouldn't that be fun? He can only move his eyes. He can only move his eyes. <laughs> so he makes it soon and he operates it all with his eye movements. Exactly. Captain America is actually like, actually like 100. And he's just like an old vet. Yeah, who did? Who hasn't died yet? Yep. So and he, he can still, still he still has the serum, so he's still strong, but he looks old. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Black Panther is a racist. He doesn't like white people at all. Yeah. And Killmonger actually has to stop Black Panther. <laughs> he's like, you can't keep killing whites, man. Yeah. To Georgia, it's damn crackers. Little little sidebar here. We talked about this a little bit last week. Did we? I don't know if we did or what not. What about Georgia? Have you seen Black Panther? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, we. Have. Okay. What's people keep saying? Killmonger is a complex character. <laughs> How? Wait, who is that? He's the villain. The, the villain. Oh. Um, In what way is he complicated? Michael Bronson Jr. Wait, <laughs> Jordan. <laughs> Jordan. Well, to me... I think he is Michael Jordan Jr. Hey, yeah. Is, is really? I, 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 I believe so. That's his name. Go ahead. Um, I don't think he's that complex. I mean, his the only situation that he's trying to... No, he's not complex. He's trying to start a race war. I think he's complex in compared to other not MCU villains that are dog shit. So what's his motivation? Power. Race war, and he's gonna get the power through a race war, right? He's gonna get the power. No, what? I haven't seen the movie. I'm just talking out of my. Are oh, you ass. talking no, about I was ass. about to say no. Well, his dad was killed by Black Panther's dad. I know that. Okay, yeah. So he and killed he Black Panther. Left in America, I think his thing is that he thinks that Wakanda could be helping struggling Black people around the world. That's his yeah. thing. Yeah. 
So he's like, we we have all this tech and all this, you know, all this this these weapons and shit. We're not helping the black yeah. people. Who what does are, he want to do with a, the weapons? He wants to arm black people around the yeah. world, like everybody, and, rather than just keeping it in Africa. And yeah. okay, so he wants to arm everybody, every black, person. every black person in America, in the on the planet, on the planet, and mm-hmm. just. Start Rise a up. Race war. Start a race war. Black power. Sorry. That's his goal then, That's right? Race war. Yeah. I, it seemed like it. it's never said, but I'm I pretty sure it's race so. war. I didn't think so. I thought his motivation was power. I think it's he race war. He wanted to gain that power. I feel like he just wanted the throne so he could start that race war, but I think his end goal was that definitely race war. I'm not saying that's a. that's. I'm not saying, like, okay, cool. If that's the villain's motivation, cool, but that's not very complicated like i don't see the good in well that. he only the only white person he killed was that one dude he killed the lady too he poisoned her coffee oh fuck he did <laughs> and that lady and that's it oh, i miss claw do you remember claw you, you haven't seen it do you remember claw the no. guy from south africa the white guy with the yes. arm gun yes. he was fun oh i love him i do so remember much. I, I i i've seen scenes of oh, the movie he's fun he's dead though yeah he got shot right fuck yeah he shot killmonger killed him Yes. Yes. He's killed three white people in the movie. He's no. South African. I don't think it Two. counts. Two? Wait. Mm. Him, the poison coffee. Who's the third white guy that he killed? Never mind. There was only two. That's <laughs> what I said. I mean, all... all <laughs> Georgia! Whatever. Anyway, they, I just wanted to ask about that because I, I didn't see the complexity of it because it, it, what it boiled down to me, what... And I haven't seen the movie. I've I've seen scenes of the movie, but I've never actually sat down and watched it beginning to end. Yeah. It seemed like he was just saying Wakanda should be using this stuff for other people. Agreed. I'm there. And then he's like, Okay, we need to arm all the black people and rise up. Then I'm like You lost me. You lost me. <laughs> I don't think that's I don't see the benefit of a race war. I don't. In it like and then it seemed like Black Panther was going, Yeah, we can't do that. And that was which it. is fair. I'm like, yeah, yeah. I'm T'Challa, like, you're right. You're right. We can. <laughs> we can't just arm everybody. No. First of all, because you can't just arm everybody because not everybody knows it's how trained. to is trained to operate a gun, so it's probably more dangerous. And than, they, don't, they don't even have guns. They have spears that shoot shit. Out yeah. At the end of it. Can you imagine? Yeah. The 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 structural damage. Uh, the friendly fire yeah. <laughs> would happen but yeah anyway i i was just curious about that i wanted your take on that but yeah uh, if, if it is about i i mean i could see how it would from the my little under like knowledge from the scenes i've seen of the mm-hmm. movie i could see it also being about power too i feel like that's what it is he's probably complex in terms of the other villains in marvel though he's like, complex like if you look at like ronin who doesn't have any yeah cur- he's just like he's complex in comparison he's like ah my religion means murder, and that's it. That's yeah. all. That's all he is. Like he, Iron Man two, that villain doesn't have anything. Right. See, oh, your dad I mean, fucked my dad. Whatever. I don't care. Now that I'm thinking about it, though, in terms of his motivation being power, so he was left in America or wherever he was at. You know, he, because yeah, the it was Oakland. You got it. Yeah, because go athletics. The one dude go killed Raiders. his dad, so he was <laughs> left in America completely powerless. The one source of his power that was there was his dad, and that was taken away. So he's trying to get back everything that he lost. In a way, though, like what Mark said, his, was he was what? Go, no, no, no. I, 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 I see where your train of thought's going. His, his motivation was complex and understandable, but his means of doing it were like. Eh, mm, not about swore. that. Mm. I don't like that. And that's the only part. Like if he was just like. I just want to, I, I want this, all this medical stuff, I want it in these uh, impoverished neighborhoods and just all over the no, world. No, 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 he's, he's like, black people are getting trounced on, let's arm them, let's rise up. Yeah, see, that's not what, I, I'm not down with that. But I'm, I mean, you wouldn't because you're white, so it's not going to end, end well It's not going to end well for me. Correct. It's really not. But no, when d- was that ever said? I don't think it's said explicitly. Explicitly, but I know he's exactly. But he's sending out troops and guns to other places. What is he? Why? Unless he plans to start a race. Why war. would you send guns out unless you impl- intended to use them? I don't them? know. I don't know. I guess you're right. I'm just gonna put them here. We're gonna leave them. We're gonna stand back. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody look at him. Nobody. Lo- I said, don't look at him. Don't stop. <laughs> Turn around. <laughs> but uh, if. <laughs> <laughs> but he was just like, oh, we're going to send all this equipment out to the places that need like it. Like medical you know? stuff. Yeah, like, that's fine. Why is Wakanda not helping these people that need help? Like, I get that. I'm down with that. And like, at, at the end of the movie, you wouldn't know, but Black Panther's like, yeah, 
he's right, and then he opens up Wakanda to the rest of the world. So he is right to an extent. Correct. It's just not totally right, mm-hmm. which makes him complicated. Okay. You turned around. All right, I've convinced myself. What yeah. an arc that we've had here today. I get it. I get it. <laughs> I understand now. I see the strings. <sighs> I get it. Now you're upset that you do get it. Like, oh God, he's right. He is complex. Yeah. Whatever. I I think what I was hung up on was his his uh what he was doing wasn't necessarily like I couldn't see the good in that aspect of what he was doing uh-huh. and then but I didn't know the rest of the story so now I know and now I understand now you're there now you're there I'm buddy. there I'm I with it provide that I still insight. think the movie's overrated <laughs> but it's okay from what I've seen of it I don't like people like oh it's bad it's not bad it's 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 good it's, it's I thought o- it was it's really okay. good yeah it's and not the perfect soundtrack amazing. soundtrack bumps Soundtrack's good. <laughs> <laughs> soundtrack is so good <laughs> it slaps oh Killmonger- soundtrack bumps dog slap killmonger's theme yes and that it's oh, like it's like shit. trap mixed with like african, african that's really cool Woo! That's it's really it, cool it was good it's really cool sick what were we talking about spider-man still we're still no, on spider-man we right? moved on from spider-man Are you sure oh wait no we didn't move on to the next topic. El Royale, tell me all about it. Oh, God. But. Okay. Okay, so uh, about a week and a half ago, I saw the movie Bad Times at the El Royale, and it's fucking great. Is it? It's so good. It's by the guy who did Cabin in the Woods. Okay. I didn't know that. Uh, Cabin in the Woods hmm. is a great time. That's a good movie. It's so good. <laughs> that ending is wild. It's that the best. That ending is wild. Is it's this just... movie good, though? Like, I really want to see Which it. one? Um... It... Bad times. Oh, it's fa- it's a fantastic movie. Is it still out? Yes. Okay. It's I might so see it this good. Weekend. It's artsy. It's fun. All the dialogue means something. It's a f- it's great. Are you out of your mind? <laughs> 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 it was the mic stand. I know what it was. No. So every okay. So start off characters. All of them are great. You got John Ham, Jeff Bridges, the man, the man, the ham, the Brit. What? The bridge. The bridge. <laughs> uh, the girl from the Fifty Shades movies. I forgot her name. Dakota uh, something. Dakota. Uh, I I know you're it's, talking. It's about. not Fanning. It's Dakota something. It's. I know you're talking. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I think Dakota's her last name. <laughs> Whatever. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it's irrelevant. Uh there's this uh, a, a black lady. I fr- I don't know her name. I've only seen her in in this thing. Okay, so the characters you have John Hamm, who's this douchey, racist, vacuum salesman right he's my favorite character he's just <laughs> he's charisma all over the place from the it's second John that you meet him and i love it jeff bridges big old dick is a priest <laughs> who isn't really a priest that's in the trailer it's not even spoiling. yeah the african well, American lady he sure doesn't act like a priest let me tell no you. he's drinking the second you see him yeah uh, the black lady is a singer who comes and uh she carries r- rugs with mm-hmm. her so she can soundproof her, her room so she so she can sing and not you know piss off people which is nice uh, thoughtful Dakota what's her dick from Shades she plays this hippie lady who is really mean all the time and that's fine because once you learn about what her situation is like oh I get it there's the bellhop who's the only working member of that hotel the hotel used to be a big place for all like rich people and celebrities and stuff now it's kind of run down he's the only one there his story is probably the most I- interesting of the whole movie it's fucking great and it's sad and it's it's like it's heartbreaking but in a good way like damn, hmm. Miles. That's his name. Miles is his name. Miles Morales. No, he's a white kid. Oh, I see. Who's that? Did I get everybody? Chris Hemsworth is in. Is yeah, in who this. does he play? He plays a cult leader. Hmm. I like that. He plays a Marilyn Manson style cult. That's what leader. I thought that he was gonna yeah, play. It makes sense leader. that he would be a cult leader. I'd follow him. I would too. <laughs> you seen that man with that <laughs> shirt would on? Too. You do a lot in this. I'll tell you what. <laughs> Hmm. Does he have a mustache in this movie? It's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> he his looks hair like looks he good, looks like though. a pedophile. I love his hair in this. Though. His hair is great. He He's got seems good to hair. always seem like wet. Like I feel like he's always. When wet. I see him, I'm always wet. <laughs> oh, we anyway. all know. I knew that was coming. Yeah, it was. And you, that you, was. you and walk you're in. Be you walk next. into that. I'm coming right. In. I need to stop. <laughs> but no, this movie is fucking great. Every time. W- what was that? What was that? Just. Thinking, thinking about, about Chris yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, the first 20 minutes of this movie are, it's perfect. Everything happens. Really? Yeah, the characters that show up, it's just a dialogue between everything, the stories we learn is great. And then as we go forward, we go back and we jump back and learn why every character is here. And when that happens, when we go to another character's perspective, there's like a t- like an artsy title card. And it's, it's, it's great. This movie is fucking, I feel like you'd like it a lot because you're into like you shots that, yeah. and film. It's perfect. It's beautiful. I, I Gorgeous need, movie. I need to watch it again. You want to go see it? Do you think it's going to win some awards? 
I think uh, the awards are bullshit. It won't win. It. Movies that I've noticed a lot of the movies I like are not winning awards. So movies that win awards are boring. Uh, I don't totally agree with that. I agree Moonlight with that won Best Picture. That haven't one year. seen it. <laughs> really <laughs> looks good. like dogs. I don't care. It's really really good. It does yeah. It doesn't look fun. See and no, it's okay, not but fun I at all. See, that. see I, that's that's not fair. Well, see, okay, La La Land was like haven't so seen it. Big. Too overhyped. It's trash. It's so <laughs> bad. It is. I liked it. Shut you up. Would <laughs> shut up. I liked it. It's so bad. The mus the music, shit, garbage. The What's acting. The Emma Stone. I don't like her in sucks. general. Yeah, she's so bad. Her eyes are so like <laughs> man. You no, know, fuck Emma Stone's and eyes. Ugly. Oh I just, god. And her face is like a box. I Jesus, just, looks Christ. like a fishbowl. Oh god, <laughs> I just hate her. I uh, I like the movie quite I a lot. Seen it. I like I, I I like the goss though. The goss. Everyone loves. He's the goss. always good though in He's every good. single movie. I'm the quite goss. a fan of the but goss. But I don't think she deserved to win Best Actress. Did she win? Did it for she that win movie? Best yes. Actress? What yes. the fuck? That's what I'm saying. See, in my opinion, okay, I don't know if, if she... Meryl Streep wins Best Actress one more year. I'm killing myself. She deserves it though. No, does she, she though? Doesn't. Yes. Thank you, Kyle. She does. Fucking overrated. No, she doesn't. She was good in Sophie's Choice. Though. I haven't seen it. She was really good. And Mamma Mia? Are you kidding me? That's not an Oscar worthy. You haven't seen? I haven't seen it either. Mamma Mia. I haven't seen it. I haven't seen him. I don't hate Meryl Streep. It's I don't. Just, I just know she's won too many fucking awards. She wins too many awards, and she's a hypocrite. There are better like actresses out there. Yeah. But I don't like to judge her acting based on her person, because I don't do that in general. Like, if you're a shitty person but a good actor, I mean, yeah. Oh, I do. I judge people based on their person. I can't. Their person. It's like, Which I... Which is why I don't like Johnny Depp, Jared Leto. Um. <laughs> well, like, think about... Okay. Kevin Spacey. Oh, Garbage can fair. human. Oh god! Oh, what an actor! I touch kids, but I'm gay, so it's fine. What an actor! That's fair. The Garbage s- the human. Spacey. Yeah. Garbage human. I actually love when people are good at acting and also just a great human being. I do like that. Brian Cranston. Ugh. Indeed. Chris uh, Hemsworth. Ugh. Uh, I would agree. Uh, what's Robert Downey. Oh, the the crack. Oh, the crack. <laughs> he he came back though. Hell yeah, he did. Came back with a vengeance. Yeah, he was great. Yeah. Uh, who who is another good actor? He's also like well, Keanu Reeves. Can, I I don't know what Keanu is like. He's a nice guy. That's good. Really nice guy. When was the last time you talked to him? I'm actually going to meet him after this. Oh, dead dead. We're ass. taking pictures together. Nice, cool yeah. with the old Keanu. Yeah. Well, he won't be wearing clothes. Now that's a huge Kia yes for me. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. You didn't have to. I did too. <laughs> I did that for you. Thank you, bud. Uh. So you like the movie? What are we talking about? Oh yeah, the movie. Yeah, I fucking mm. loved it. It's great. You should both go to go see it. I will now. see it with you again. When? I don't know. I'll see it. Perhaps I'll see it again. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. That's about yep, yeah, sure. We can do that. Maybe. We'll Maybe. see. We'll I, see what I, happens. I, I might stand you up. I'll still go. I don't I don't give a shit. I'll still see it. <laughs> I see things alone all the time. I I've done it before. It's it's underrated. I don't know why this the stigma that you have to go with somebody to. I've I've told that to my mom before. I'm like, "Hey, I'm going to see a movie." She's like, "Who who are you going with?" I'm like, like "Alone, Raf." <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going. I'm going alone. Nobody else wants to see this movie but me. Like yeah. I, went, I went to see a, uh uh what's that movie called? Um It Comes at Night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw it alone. How was that? <sighs> Great. Is that the one where there's Very a good. but there's a red door or something in the yep. house? Okay, yeah, yeah. Is there actually something at night or is it all in their in their head? Do you want me to spoil it? I don't care. I'm not going to. What about you, see Georgia? It. Do you want to see it? Wait. What? I can't remember if I've seen this movie or not. It's got Joel Edgerton. The guy it, from it Planet of the Apes. Night. I don't think I've seen it, but go ahead and spoil it. They're really... My understanding Fuck, of the movie... Fuck. It's not. <laughs> my, uh, okay. Simple answer, no. There's nothing. Damn it. But my understanding of it is it's more complicated than that. I don't want to say... Oh, this was a mind monster. Fuck me. Kind of, but I don't want to say it's like the, oh, human evil is the <laughs> real monster, and I think that's what they were really going for. I bet but they were. I didn't get that impression because, like, there's a scene. It's one of my favorite scenes in the movie. It, it's also part of the poster. The dog is just looking out into nothing and, like, barking. And, like, it clearly sees something that nobody else can see. So I'm like, what the fuck does he see? Never tell you. Wow. You never know what they see. It's dog shit. I imagine it's shat somewhere soon after that because it's a dog. I bet it did. Dogs did. And shit. then maybe licked it. Cor- <laughs> <laughs> As they do. <laughs> God. It sure did, I bet. I need to go back and watch Cabin in the Woods. It's a good oh, movie. He just said Cabin in the Woods. <laughs> yeah, I, you heard me. It's Cabin in the Woods. 
<laughs> so good. Hey, Chris Hemsworth is also in that. He is. Oh fuck! There's I'm noticing also a pattern. A Power Ranger actress in there too. I didn't. I, I didn't know this till like re- recently. But in El Royale? No, no, no. In uh, Captain the Hoods. Oh. I thought my mic was off. <laughs> no, I I'm like, he, I'm like he, he, he doesn't deserve to talk anymore. Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah. I, 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 I thought your sandwich got stuck in the boards oh, and then it <laughs> cut my mic off. <laughs> <laughs> the old crumbs got on the board again. <laughs> uh, but anyway, so um, what, what were you talking about? Oh, Royale. Yeah, I know, but like what with was, cheese. Oh no, I was talking about the. Uh, it comes at night. Correct. There is some sort of infection. That's. That, 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 that's what I thought it was, but I didn't know it's what was something outside like, the door. But when it says it comes at night, I don't know if it's referring to the sickness or if it's referring to the uh, human evil. Yes, like all flus, it can o- only travel during the nighttime hours. Right. Mm-hmm. Indeed. Hmm. Correct. It yeah. is strange how they... G- have you seen it? No, I no. I thought I was thinking of a different movie. It's good. I'd recommend it. Since you like horror, I think you'd really enjoy There's it. There's a movie... The movie that I thought you were talking about is on Netflix, and it's like... Um, don't hold on to the dark or something like that. Oh, I understand about. Yeah. Is that what it's called? I don't know, but I, I I I know I know what you're talking about, but I don't know the name of it. Hold on, dark. wait. Let no, 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 me... it's something. Don't hold dark. Something. Mm. Um. Thanks. I just helped a real lot there, guys. You helped me absolutely none. Hold on. Let me just yeah. search it. It'd be like that. A, a, a lot of those Netflix movies, those Netflix version movies, are actually pretty good. Yeah, like this one was. Really, really good, and I think except you would like for that. the extinction, the extinction is dog shit. It's called Hold the Dark. Mm-hmm. Really good, Kyle. You would like that. What's it about? Hold the Dark. Hold the Dark is about. It takes place in Alaska, and the first shot is like you see this wolf, and this kid is playing in the snow, and then you know it pans back to the wolf, and they're he's just taking like, a shit, <laughs> and then licks it. No, <laughs> but they're like looking at each other, and then. Jeffrey Wright's in this. I like Jeffrey Wright. Yeah. And then he just gets up. Like, the little kid gets up, and then, you know, he's never seen. And so the mom, like, calls this guy or writes a letter to this guy and is like, you hunt wolves. I need you to hunt this wolf down. I haven't been able to find oh, it. Wow. It ate my son or whatever. Jesus Christ. And then you find out. I don't know if you want me to spoil it's it. It's a werewolf. You can. I probably won't um, The it. mom killed the kid. Oh, and then fuck. Instead of the wolf. Yeah. And it's really weird. And then, like, the husband. So she sent this man on a on a wild wolf chase. Yes. Well, the husband was in Afghanistan and comes back and is then him and the dude are hunting the wife. I don't know. It's a really weird situation. It's really good, though. Strange. It has really good build up. I just spoiled it, but. I won't watch it. Me I didn't either. think that you would. Me neither. I still need to watch. Oh, there is a show, though, that's new on Netflix called The Haunting at the Hill House or whatever. Yeah, I heard of it. Yeah, um, it's really Based good. Based off a book. Really good. You fucking nerds. Based really off the. Good. You ever read The Lottery by Shirley Jackson? Nope. Mm-mm. You didn't. You didn't have to read that in high school? No. It's a short story. I never read it in high school. Mm-hmm. Wait. It's about the one where. It. It's the one where everyone takes a little. A, a lottery ticket, and then whoever has like the black mark ticket oh, stone. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. I read she, that. Yeah, yeah. She she wrote the Haunting of Hill oh, House. Oh wow, really? Yep. It's really good. Um, I think that you should watch it. It's only ten episodes. Each episode is an hour. I'm only oh, on fuck. episode two, and I can tell you that it's really good. It's pretty scary, and it's not jump scares either. Thank God. Because I don't like jump scares. I like things that genuinely are going to freak me out, and it does. I haven't seen a movie that genuinely scared me in a very long time the, in this show and i don't know why because it's not like i'm some billy badass or anything billy no badass. yeah i'm the same way like i've been able to watch so many scary movies and not be scared but this one like i am like freaked out by it did you guys watch that slender man movie that came out Fuck no it Fuck got no. terrible it's dog shit terrible reviews i don't care about reviews but i uh, I was really into Slender Man as a kid. Like, I, I like the I- idea of this creature that uh, that uh, the more that you thought about him, the the more he like fucked with you. Mm-hmm. That's his thing. Like, once you start thinking about him, he's like, oh, I'm gonna but fuck not with scary him more. Looking. He's not in the movie, but he's terrifying as an idea. Yeah, this sure. nine feet tall man with no face in, in a suit who doesn't move when you're looking at him—that's terrifying. Okay. And the movie was dog was fucking dog shit. The speaking of scary things. When I was looking at the scenes for Venom, mm-hmm. when he talks, <laughs> who talks? I, when Venom speaks, I'm not. He doesn't look scary anymore. He's he's not. Scary. He looks scary to me. I think he he's looks cute. he looks freaky, but I don't know. Just some. I, 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 
I I don't have the same fear of him like I did. Yeah. I don't think you're I don't think you're supposed to fear him though. Probably not. I think people in that world are, but you're supposed to seem like oh he's he's a cool guy. I get drinks with him, and I would. Yeah. Can you imagine him? Can I he be a his, good time? Can he put his teeth away? I think he could if you wanted like, to. Just like sheath them, you know. Uh, put the his lips toothless over. from How to Train Your Dragon. You think that's you could what pull I was that? exactly yes, what sir. I was thinking. <laughs> you could pull a toothless. That's another movie I can't Just wait to see. Sheath them. <laughs> How to Train Your Dragon three. three. I can't explain why those movies are so fucking good, but they're really they're good. They're amazing. Shut up. But what? what? Shut up. What do you mean, pussy? They're not good. Yes, they are. They're trash. Are you out of your goddamn mind? They're so bad. They're so good. It's. Uh, <laughs> it's so good. What are you talking about? I don't think that they're what? good. I they're so think... mature and like they are. They're very like real problems. Like it, like it does not pull any punches. I don't know. His dad fucking dies in the second one, right? Yeah, and it's not like it's not like he gets wounded and then he has final words with his no! eyes. He fucking eviscerated. <laughs> He's gone. <laughs> And he does not get another word no, with sir. him. Mm-mm. He he's like hiccup ah dead <laughs> gone. That's the end. Oh, fuck. it's amazing. He loses his fucking leg in movie one. Yes, he does. He's like he's like oh most of him. You know, got to save most and his of him. Fucking leg is gone. Yeah, and he's still a capable like human being. He's you know, more, I'd say he's more I than. Until that you guys are passionate about. I because they're good movies. <laughs> it's, okay, that's DreamWorks' best franchise. I'd say that. What else has uh, DreamWorks made? Shrek. No, they haven't. Did Some, they but <laughs> yeah, but Shrek. Only the first Shrek is good. True, but and both Dragon movies are great. And like they're both equally great. good. Shrek two I is dog shit. Shrek, Shrek three is worse. Shrek four we don't talk about. <laughs> is, is is there I a five? Sh- Who fucking cares? I thought Shrek two is pretty good. Shrek two it's okay, fine. but it's not better than Shrek one. No, Shrek yeah. one is a cla- Shrek. Shrek one is golden. Did you just whatever? Shrek one is <laughs> the classic that you've heard. Oh yeah, it is that and more. In the morning, have you seen Shrek the musical? Huh? What's up? Have you seen Shrek the musical? No. Nope. Oh, it's so good. It's uh, so I, funny. Uh, Why would I see a big green man? It's so funny. Oh, it's hilarious. Did hilarious. you guys ever do the uh, Shrek 4D ride? Yes. <laughs> it's so it's fun. It's trash. It's so bad. <laughs> what? Though. Compared to all the other 4D rides. You don't like things roads? we like. Oh, okay. I but think compared this, I, to I all the other 4D rides. I think that the, the story is fun. That it's, it's, it's Lord Farquaad's ghost. Yeah. Still trying to fuck Fiona. <laughs> 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 yes. It's so great. But compared to all the other 4D rides, that's the what, worst one. What's the, what, what other 4D like right, the right Jimmy there. Fallon one, the um, Transformer one, the Jimmy Fallon one. I don't like Jimmy Fallon. Is it's the Transformer one 4D? Yeah, I what went are you on talking it. about Transformers it. Universal King Studios. Kong. Never been. Okay. Um, uh, Despicable that Transformers Me. one is dog shit. Maybe because I just don't Fast like that world at all. Fast and Furious is also dog shit. I thought um, you loved Transformers. Harry fucking Potter. I like Transformers as an idea, but the the movies that have come out of it have been terrible because they don't stand true to what those characters are. My friend is here, and we're doing the pictures afterwards, so I need to go grab her, because she doesn't know where the fuck this oh, is. Alright, we'll so be here. you guys keep going. What do you want us to What time to are we about? at? Uh, one thirty-two. Oh, shit. Are we gonna... It's... O- it's soon? it's only 4.12. Yeah, I know, but we're at an hour and 30 minutes. Who cares? Do you Jesus. have to be somewhere? This is longer than the How to Train Your Dragon movie. Oh, was that a shot, or is it just like a, a <laughs> state? That's just a that's that just, just a, a just a general statement. You're the worst. <laughs> God, you said you had some uh, what ifs for us. Yes, I did. Just, just give me one. Okay, so what if? <sighs> it's what right if... in front of you. Just <laughs> read it for me. Okay, but I got rid of them. So oh my God. So the ones that I first looked at weren't really that good. <laughs> but what if? Um, the Earth was twice as big as it is now, like twice as big. God, I hate this fucking mic. Are we talking like land mass, or is, yes. it, is it just so water, or if the diameter was doubled to about sixteen thousand miles? Say that word again for me. If the planet's diameter, okay, cool, were doubled <laughs> to about sixteen thousand miles, the planet's mass would increase eight times, and the force of gravity on the planet would be twice as strong. Oh shit. Shit, more gravity. Yes, all That's the plants negative. and animals that currently exist would collapse under their own doubled weight. Oh, so we die. Yes. So the what if is just it's oh we're we gonna die. die. This is a terrible what yeah, if. These were what if? Bad. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> what if everyone on Earth jumped at once? 
I don't think anything would happen. Do you really? I do. That's why I'm saying it. Do you think something would happen? I mean, it if it says the, if all seven granted, billion of the, us, granted, the world is flat, so it definitely would have an impact of okay, some sort. But listen, so <laughs> it says if all seven billion of us crowded close together and jumped, we would make the Earth move just one hundredth of the radius of a single atom per second. So when nothing. we landed, Earth would move back into place like a spring. Yes. So nothing would happen. Nothing. Kyle is calling me. Hold on. Oh my God. Yes, Kyle. Hey, can you come open the door? What door? Oh, he's talking about that door because it, it doesn't, that that oh. one locks. I'll talk. I'll talk to myself. Don't worry about it. Okay. Go ahead. Have fun. I will. I'm not going to come back. She's not going to come back. It's just me now, guys. You're stuck with me now. I will. I will tell a personal story. So, my father. <laughs> uh, now, uh, Kyle wants to know why I like Power Rangers so much. He's wanted to know that for a while, and I honestly don't know if we're going to get to that, but... I don't know. I was going to say it here, but they're they're going to walk in any second now, so we'll see what happens. We're not professional. I'm sorry that we're like this. We're very jumbled a lot. We're bad at our jobs, guys. I wouldn't call us a job because we don't get paid, but we get paid with the, the satisfaction knowing that some of you like some of these, so thank you for that, guys. Thank you so, so much. How long does it take for her to open a door? This is ridiculous. Why am I friends with these fucking, fucking people? Oh, just the people I was, I was, I was talking about. I was talking about how shit you, you all are. I was like, wow, George and Kyle, what a bunch of dickheads. I'm, <laughs> I'm not lying. They're back, guys. I'm not lonely anymore. What was that? I can't hear you, Kyle. Am I still on? Yes. I no, me. I turned you off hours ago. Uh, we <laughs> we know. We got a, uh, I had to go get two people. I thought I was only getting one, but oh, I, got, two. I, got, I got two for the uh, price of one. I only saw one. I was like, what are you talking How about? How much did you pay? I uh, didn't like the connotation of that. Enough. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh my but yeah, uh, uh, my friends uh, Sarah and Marie, my very, very good friends. Um, Are they your very, very good friends? Yes. How many varies do we want to ask? Quite a, quite a number. Wait, what kind of very? Like V A R Y? Very. What v -A -R -I? made her like this? I. <laughs> <laughs> what made her this way? Uh, no, well, it all uh, started. Shut up. <laughs> they're uh, they're 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 good people. Real good. That's good. Uh, so what were we talking about? Nothing of use. George gave me a what if that was dog shit, and we moved on. What was yeah. the question? Um, what would happen if the Earth size increased by two? If and the Earth then was... And the no. <laughs> if the Earth were to, like, increase... And then double she just size, told me that the... What would happen? Gravity would double, so we'd all die. Yeah. So that's the what if. Like, that was the I'm, explanation. I'm going to need another one. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. They're, the ones that I looked up weren't good. What if... Um, what if women actually made the first move? On Tinder. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what if? She said, Tinder. <laughs> <laughs> what if? I mean, but we will never know because that will never happen. So. God. It's horse shit. It is horse <laughs> shit. What that is. <laughs> Ridiculous. Just get Bumble. Do you want your notebook back? I don't need it yet. I do. I don't need Let's that. see what we got in the uh, stretch. The old tank. See what we got in the tank, brother. We've been going Fuel for an hour and 30 tank. minutes. Yes. It's, uh, we're at an hour 37. Right now, Jesus. So what you, uh, we can end it with uh, what you guys been doing lately. What, 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 been what doing? is your what is your plans this weekend? Let's talk about um, that. Tell, tell me all about today. It. I have a date with my boyfriend. Oh. We are going to the Frist, oh. and then we are going to oh. California. Um, Pizza the Kitchen. state? Oh, Pizza what is Kitchen. the Frist? It's an art museum. That's what it is in Kay. Nashville. All right, and then I'm gonna watch. We're gonna come back and watch the haunting of the Hill House all weekend. Nice, nice. Kyle, what about you, Doug? What you doing? I, not much. What are your plans? That's not what I wanted to hear. Fix it. Think of something right now. <laughs> Think of something right <laughs> fucking now. <laughs> I'm going to, uh, well, tonight I'm going to probably... Touch yourself. <sighs> gotta, gotta, That's gotta his keep, uncle's job. Oh, keep, guess, my God. <laughs> gotta keep it tender, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Ew. You gotta keep the meat malleable. Oh my god! Oh god, it's got to be able to make it. All right, shapes. you've you've done your bit. <laughs> okay. Anyway, uh, did you do the same thing with your paperclip? Yes, yeah! we did the thing. <laughs> as for SpongeBob, as for Sandy, yeah. we're the worst. I apologize. <laughs> <laughs> well, tonight I'm probably gonna watch uh, the Dodgers Brewers game. Daredevil season three. Is that tonight? It's uh, it's it's uh, it's already out, dog. You're shitting me. It's already out. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'll be watching Daredevil tonight. That's nice, what I'm gonna be doing. Nice, oh, nice. I can't believe it's it. Out. It came out like four a.m. I think. Wow. Yes, sir. I didn't know that. It's out. It's That's real. Amazing. That's great. Hope it is. I'm probably gonna do that. I need some more Willie Fisk in my life. 
Is he the villain? No, Bullseye's the villain, I Bullseye's think. Bullseye's the villain. Seems like. But Fisk is in it, yeah. Good. He's out of prison or something. Good, good. Uh, and he's got the all white suit now, which I dig. Ooh, I like that. Yes, sir. He needs more of that. Comic accurate. I fuck. I, f- I fucks with it. I fuck with that. I fucks big with old that. man, baby. Hey, big old boy. He's a big he's old a big head. Old man, baby. Yep. Jesus Christ. Uh, okay, yeah. And then after that, um, probably gonna play some Alien Isolation for nice. the. Uh, I'm doing the broadcast thing for Halloween, and I got to talk about Alien Isolation. So for the. Broadcast thing? Yeah. Why is that? It's for pee play. What's pee It's play? a show I help out Where with. Where they play really? with their penis. penis. Why didn't you, Okay, Georgia. I Okay. I didn't like that you did that. I didn't like that you didn't go fully in. I didn't want to commit. You second guessed yourself. I did. And, and I, I don't commit. respect that. You should have committed. Yeah. Ridiculous. I agree. Actually. Ridiculous. And uh, when, I get done, when I get done with here, we're going to go uh, uh, take pictures. But that's the only other thing. It's going to be of me naked, just so you guys are, are Marcus! Aware. What's up? What are your plans for this weekend? Oh, uh, same as Kyle. Daredevil season three. It's going to happen. It has to. I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to finish pro- it. I'm probably going to finish it tonight, if if, if I okay. can. Yeah. And then Black Ops 4, I've been getting into that shit, which is really good, actually. I, I didn't ex- expect it to be good, but it's good. My exact words oh, were, this, this same time last year... <laughs> yeah, like that? No, 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 <laughs> sir. My, my exact words were, I'm not letting... Uh, the Call of Duty franchise get another dime from me, and then I spent sixty dollars. <laughs> you gave him a couple dimes. I come, more than enough. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so uh, Daredevil season three, Black Ops four. Uh, I started Friends, and I really like Friends, so I'm it's gonna watch show. as much Friends as I, I can. I fin- I that reminds me, I finished the Terror, that show I was telling you about. Yeah. Yep. Quality. Oh. <laughs> Uh, watch quality. God, the Mark. show. <laughs> God. Watch the show. You will very much enjoy it. It's <laughs> uh, it's nice. It's the first show to kind of give me the heebie-jeebies. Yo, old heebie-jeebies. Watch this show that I'm talking about. Was it in a no. movie? Was it, wasn't it, was it in a movie? What Georgia, wait, 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 read wait. my lips. No. <laughs> Close my eyes. <laughs> No, I probably will. I'll probably check it out. Because okay. I saw it a couple times. But Daredevil will. first. Then I got to get through Ozark. And yeah. Is Ozark any good? Yeah. Isn't it like a crime drama thing? Mm-hmm. It sounds like it's some like. You'd like it. Science fiction crap, but it's not. Ozark, like, Missouri. Ozark. Like Ozark. Like Ozark's a wizard or something. <laughs> no, it's Ozark, Missouri. So. Oh, fuck. Really? Yep. Fucking Missouri. Mm. You'd like it. What well. I get them old country boys in there. Oh, shit. The old country bumpkins. Oh, selling drugs. Okay. Country bumpkins. <laughs> well. <laughs> That is you don't get to wrap it up. <laughs> He's the producer. He gets to wrap it up. I'm the man in the big chair. The man in the high castle. That's a Nazi joke. I think we all have the same chair. Nope. <laughs> Mine's leather. Right, Kyle? What's my chair m- made of? Cashmere. <laughs> Damn straight. Oh, God. Bones of my enemies. <laughs> all right, you guys want to shout somebody out? Uh, hey, Mom. I can't, I, can't believe, I can't believe your mom listens Fucking to day. us. All right, Mark. Why do I have to shout out somebody? You, you go first, buddy. Uh, I'll shout out my, my two good friends, Sarah and Marie. They're in the back. They just they waved. waved, for those of you who can't see, because you wouldn't be... You, you can't see, but they waved. Yeah. Pour one out for Sarah. Do you want to shout out your uh, boss again? Because you shout out your boss every week. Well, I shout out somebody at work, so I'll shout out... Uh, who I shout out this week? I'll shout out Becca. My friend Becca. Hey Becca. Her name is Rebecca, but we call her Becca. As most, and she gives me a lot of Rebecca's shit. Becca's do though, really? Yeah. She, oh yes. <laughs> Mark, Mark, shout out your dad. Tell him that I said hi. You just hey said, George. Hey. I'm gonna shout out my dad George. Um, he's hi. not gonna George stop. She gotta stop. You're so fucking weird. You and Tristan. God. Are just fucking <laughs> For those weird. of you who aren't aware, <laughs> Tristan thinks that my mom is really hot, and Georgia thinks my father George is stupid hot. Never said that. You said it to me like, the like gene, an hour ago. And Mark's at the gene pool lottery. <laughs> so he says. Frankly. I mean, I haven't seen his mom, but just looking at is your it, dad. You haven't seen, you haven't, you haven't seen my seen mom, mom yet? Nope. Oh, wow. Well. But your to... dad is, is a very handsome man. Yeah, yeah, he is. Yeah. Yeah. And he can shake a hand real well. He's cute. He can. He's my like, dad's a cute guy. He's got a grip on him, I'll tell you what. <sighs> it, and, 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 he, and he like he fist bumped you, but then he shook my hand. Oh, yeah. My, so dad, I kind of my dad shakes to kill. <laughs> He's yeah. not fucking around. Yeah. Oh, George. Okay. Anyway, is that the show? We're in an Thank hour you. and forty-five minutes. God damn! What a time to be alive. Thank you. I for still feel listening. like that movie one is the longest, but I know it's not really. I know. It's I think not. this is the longest. It's just a. It's just a lot of nothing. That's why it seems so long. 
Yep. No offense. Yeah. <laughs> to any of y'all. We need to figure. Go this back, out. watch uh five. Go. I will. R- she hasn't listened to the last one yet. Sharp Rock, which is my personal favorite. Okay. Well, fuck you. It, it, it's no, it's just us yelling, and I love that. When when Tristan goes in on Venom, it, it it's so <laughs> funny. <laughs> it is really funny. It's really good. That whole bit is pretty pretty. We pretty should fun. have him back. We should have him back. We should have them both back. Yeah. Han and, back. and Tristan. Yeah. Uh, Tan and Han. Tan hands. As in tri- <sighs> Close the Thank show. Thank you for right. watching. <laughs> 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 All right, guys. Thanks for listening to episode six. Six of What are we calling this? Bottle. We're going to call this wh- God, God Dick. God Dick. We're naming it God, God Dick. <laughs> That's what we're calling it. <laughs> Thank you for listening to Egg in a Bottle episode six. God Dick. We'll, <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back next week. Thanks, guys. We love you. God. Bye, Bye guys. Dick.